There's no much entry, sorry for the holdout. Um, let's put in that new chair together. We're chilling. Okay. So, yeah. Going with now on our conquest. Might actually let's go around and take down some enemies of Milani real quick. Could also get a few more specialties too. There's much to think about, and it's just daily check and reward. Okay. So in that case, we've also got some of these rewards to start collecting, which is nice. Hmm. Again, much to think about. Do I have problems with I stay in open? No, not really. Okay. Let me find but maybe I'll aim it a little bit lower, camera a little bit lower just to be sure. Yeah, probably. Should hopefully solve any issues I've got. Okay. So actually both around here, which is very convenient. Very, very very busy man. Calm down, sparring partners in the wild. This would actually be a decent way to get over there. Why have Silent Realm illuminated by glowing waters? Aw. So there's also a teleport waypoint right over there that I could make use of and probably should. Okay. Just get that started so we can go around the area more quickly and more efficiently. And let's go on up. And even though it's not activated, it'll still give us full distance back, which is nice. And right over here should be a group of travel warriors. Pretty convenient. It's all around here. Got some signs of the canopy stuff here. I guess all this is sort of the Children of Echoes area. Like, sort of starting to get into Yumkasura area here. So in that case, take out a few of you, yeah. Okay. Just like this, and thanks, thanks, right, and get the knights all back, keep on bombarding. Doing very well for ourselves here. Cycle, right, and fight again. Mm -hmm. Even though she is nowhere near for the level, we're doing okay enough. And oh, come on. If we get knocked out, we definitely got knocked out. Luckily, we get give her a hit with that, but still. My feeling is also a little annoying. Well, alright. Get a bit of that going. Fight! And. Right. Two. Right. One, two, three, fight! Uh, much to think about. So you can put that down there. Luckily, not as if she has a particular cooldown. Some small respite. Mm -hmm. One, three, okay. Two, three. Oh, wow. Well, it's almost there. Okay. And toss. Well, kind of worked. So my question is. Still don't have. Quite enough for an ascension. Uh, leveling Kachina along with her is going to be kind of tough too. Luckily, I can collect most of the specialties. They'll need period now, but still. That pregnant defense, that's right by there, okay. And a couple more statues I've got to unlock before all of them show up. Uh, Wayland Monolith. Over here, Ikuyo. Hello there. Mm. Well, I guess we can put that down while we try to get that going. And fight, hit to fight, keep on fighting. Mm. Not being able to vaporize anything is still hurting things. And that doesn't get us off the shark. Is the issue? Oh wow. 
Start again, and... Uh, very, very silly thing to be trying to use here. Okay. Come on. Come on. We have the focus we need. And... Oh, please. Right. Uh, come on. Really? Okay. And... A couple more bites. And hit. But, well, that damn was not fun to take. And... Start again. Go for the big shot. And the arrow was decent enough. Decent enough. So actually, serving through a whole group of them is rather good. But even still, whatever. I did not mean to do it like that. Okay. Come on. And uh, we didn't get precise reaction I would have wanted. Oh well. And out of the way. We got hit by the balloon, though it was the thing. Come on. This, hopefully. That down. I did not mean to do that. Whatever. Who's gonna crystallize? Got a bonus, which is good, but still. No. Right on there. Oh, there's the problem. Okay. And is this thing actually gonna break? Yeah, it actually broke. We really need to use the Emily Burst for it, and now it's gone. Uh, roll to level 9 is not a joke. Hmm. At least not being able to actually level them up immediately. Having a party of rather non synergistic characters is the issue. Oh, and it's still there. How fun. Well, whatever. And just like this. Okay. Cool. Oh, bite. I'm biting. Gotta be fair. Chin it down for the bonus would definitely help a bit at least. Well, she's got good at the moment. Come on. And bite. And let's put you down. Thanks. And. Oh, come on. That is definitely a bit overkill. Oh well. Hello, how are you doing? Long time no see. Good to see ya. And just like that, we'll put down Kachina. And go for some blades. So well we can continue this up. Very interesting how this goes. Oh, laggy? What are you, a computer? Maybe don't answer that question. Okay, and the second it put this down. And keep on fighting. Fight and come on. How many? Fight. And fight again. Hit Oh, oh okay. They're very unique. It's a lot of fun. So, put that down there. You down actually to get this going, but uh, so irritating how that works. Come on. Because we're actually in a position where I'm... I can't kill these guys in time. They're actually ridiculous. This is stupid. Uh, I just don't have a party that works. Because I'm trying to have all the characters who need friendship. The issue is that Emily is goddamn useless unless there's a burning character in the party. Well, someone to apply pyro. You know, unless you've got someone applying pyro, she has basically zero functionality. Which is her gimmick. Well, many things are. Many things are stupid. This may come as a surprise to you. Okay, shut up. I'm not the one who decided to make her kit work that way. <laughs> Over here. The stone. Get on field. I'm biting. Should be able to get some good vaporizes, hopefully. But, uh, trying to actually get their friendship up is really just pain and suffering. Okay. Try harder. And, uh... Fire World Love is also rather crazy. Okay. 
And, oh, oh, annoying. Well, I... I didn't know we were still in cooldown for... Still counted as dash. Whatever. And... Okay. Is that supposed to be a compliment? Okay. This down, put this down. Put you down, and there we go. Get that on. Fight. Go for a bit more. But again, this will hopefully do the trick. Who knows, really? And, okay, where is. Uh, annoying. Get over here, why don't you? The fact that they're keeping their distance is what's really annoying about this. Whatever, whatever. And big wave. And go in. Who is? Oh, come on. Fight. Hit and. Ooh, ooh. Oh, but they just can't. How'd they dodge? What the hell? Hate this stupid game. Okay. Well, we can. Finally, we had to take the hit ourselves. Genuinely, this is rather insane. You know? I'm not sure whether I'm glad or not that we don't have a 100 character ascension. Don't know whether that's good or bad for me right now, but... Who am I going to put in once Kira is done? Because Amway is still going to stay on all Kinichi's up. It... Actually running domains with this team is... Legitimately hellish, too. So... We'll just go overland, find that other commission. Like I said, I might actually want to go grabbing some specialties before I... take on the next phase of the quest. Maybe. And that... Okay, it's just over here, or... Oh, it's actually on top. Huh. Well, whatever. We'll climb up, use our Nutsal Transmission, go up top here, just bounce our way up, thank you. And there we are. And over there, we've got another Statue of the Seven. It's over that way. So that'll work. That'll be good. And use my Nutsal Transmission to switch to Gashina fast and fast. Over... New overland. Past the dinosaurs. This is gonna be the one for the Dendro tribe area. So we'll check up top here. And here we are. Let's open this up. Oh, can't be performed during combat, but can it be performed while I'm in Night Soul State? When are they gonna just go away? They can't reach me here. Come on. Give up! Give up already. Okay, now they've given up. Oh, and it takes you off the top. Okay. Signs of the canopy. Ancestral temple. Mark this off. Honestly, want to wait until I have Keenich to actually explore most of this area. Quadipec Mountain. Okay. Interesting. Got the mountain and then the water. All got sort of similar areas, but it's interesting that a lot of this water is technically part of Quapitec, which makes it the biggest single area, I think. Even though most of it is, of course, water, which sort of intersects with what they've got, go got going on here. And that signs of the canopies questline. That's interesting because this is their building. Hmm. To get over here, I guess I could just hop over the mountain. Probably the best way there. Okay. But of course, do you also want to probably do a little bit of farming around. So we climb up, switch to Kachina. You can press the E skill again in order to get a little few more Midnight Soul. Points. And now that water's around here, we can switch over to Milani, who is going to be very, very good at traversing here. 
Mayoko water is at Nela. Sour sauce kipper. What's wrong with it? Nothing really. How good it is can't keep eating the same thing day after day. On the other hand, Ripple's getting a bit pudgy. Neither is trend nor is cork. Input take up change. Huh. So, we'll hop off over here. Lots of them, and yep, these are Milani's materials, so good place to look for them. But of course, we'll also need to take on the enemies that are part of the quest. Okay, statues over there, though. Perpetual surfing is pretty fun. Set, you can keep going somewhat perpetually. You switch back and forth using Night Soul Transmission. But you need to have a character who doesn't have a Night Soul Transmission state. And do that to keep things going somewhat indefinitely without having a Ron Fulgiston. Though to be fair, that's not really necessary considering how easy it is to get Fulgiston around you in the waters. Mm. We will interact with our statue of the seven over there. And finally make the map current not one complete. So what's up? Let's just over that way. Okay. Thank you. We will keep moving around. This is by a little underground area I went to as part of a world quest. Early, actually, while I was looking for specialties, because that right there goes up to the island in the sky. Not all of which we've seen yet. So, for those with noble hearts. And here we are, people at the springs, Amayoko Waters. That's the underground lava river, which we've seen a decent amount of. Also, we have the Sky Islands, which don't show up normally. It's on an upper map layer, which may be the first time we've seen that done. Pretty sure there's another island right here, but we'll see that eventually. Okay. She's over there, but... Again, I think I actually want to go and try to get the remaining specialties. Continental Explorer, Pyre Plains. Land of Fire and Competition, Light of the Four in First Stage. Joy of the Contest, Victor Vanquish, or an Honor Equal Measure, both belonging to the Flames of the Night. Okay. So in that case, well, actually, since I'm not doing... No, I do have one more daily to do, and it's this one over here. Tending to a typically saurus. Hmm. See how that works. What that entails. Switch to Kachina then, I guess. Very fun, though, given that she'll almost certainly be power cracked by Sheila in the next patch. We'll see how long that lasts. That said, in theory, you could climb very well by using Night Soul Transmission with the both of them. Maybe, okay, and that does not give any Fulgiston back. So these ones, I believe, get used for Kinich. It'll eventually be nice for us, and oh, it puts us straight into the quest. Cause call, or it'd be a good bonus. Stay still, it's gonna be a quick wipe down, whimper, roar. Another one, but we can take a bath, pull over there, got to clean up, come right back, keep playing, waru. Don't run off, so we gotta find it again, presumably. You're right off my feet. To visit, while well, it's still standing there, sorry about him. Being too energetic, dashing all over the place in front of you. Coastman taking a bath just now, like beg him, running a lot of fast days, covering mud when he goes out to play, trying to get him cleaned up, let's run around all day and play, or every person can't keep up with him. Worrying him over with food, try that already, knows exactly what I'm trying to do, faint disinterest, so as he sees me standing nearby. Just glance away, Bert was way over, eating all of them and go, drill back down, making good his escape. It's as if he's a typically Saurus. Exactly, can't imagine what kind of trouble it caused when he's full grown. Doesn't end up wrecking Chevin's store, no way I'll be able to reimburse her if she smashes the gemstones. Boss's idea, try, interested in the ball. Charge of looking up, typically Saurus, smart fellow, expert in music, everyone likes him, last time I talked to him about it. Looking for a drifty ball from Mata'oho, Saurians love it. Just making one for... The little dinosaur, finished gathering materials, aren't ready to get started. Just playing up again, wearing pants, say they were full of ants, drifty ball indeed is all I've got. Think I can help with, want to help out, something as nice as you, box over there, ember core stems. Started on the frame. <laughs> Switch inside the box. Back. And he's still over there. 
got to say tonight, tonight, how you're meant to do this. Let's investigate a little. So, the Ember Core stems. What do you have to say? Woo -hoo. So, where's that box? Search inside the box. Let's search the boxes. Bundle of Ember Core stems. Okay. No item. And we just gotta go back to him. Hello. That's the one thing. Just out. Cut my finger tying the frame. Have trouble fiddly work. Moment to tie it. Onto the frame. Co cover with cloth. With drifty bulb. Mentioning after cutting the sand three more times. Finish. Go find horror. Digging it underneath the tree. Bent your hand up first. But a scratch. But a flesh wound. A rag to wrap it up with later. Let's go find horror before it gets too carried away. Drifty bolt in the center of the pool. Give him a good watch down too. Have to go alone. The center counting on you. Hope the dragon likes it. So are there any other options? If we just talk to him, okay. There's no sort of special failure state. Alright. Drifty bolt in the pool. And well that's cute. Cute little beach ball. Watch the reaction. And will this work or I don't know. Okay, so he does get in the water. Hear him splash around a little. Cute. So I guess that's it. Roo 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 woo roo. Grabs the ball, rolling around the pool, some water splashes over it, washing his mud off. Well rascal likes the ball, and we thought they start playing it in the pool right away. Head over it counts as a good wash. Okay. And roar roar. Like that, it's yours. Roo roo. Take a bath wasn't easy. Now how to deal with you. Roo roo. Touch my hand, just scratches. Whimper, go all of a sudden, having a great time, haven't worn yourself out with playing. Thanks for your help, these are for you, nothing valuable, just take them, okay. Now back to the pool, just dried you off, and now he has another problem. Okay. Right here we do have... A couple of... One Saurian warrior to take on. Okay, Forge Sand Interrogator. So... Oh goodness. Come on. Come on. Back and uh, bite, bite again. Bite should help a little. Mm, this is still a bit more annoying than I like. When we crit, we crit big. Thanks. Uh, and one more bite, and that did it. Okay. Another metal whistle. Farming that might end up being. Kind of troublesome, yeah. So we got some back from harvesting, because uh, I believe that's Kachina's passive. And now we need to destroy some towers. Okay, so climbing up around here, around Tetikpak Peak, would be a good idea. So Kachina should help us get up there, presumably. Teleport waypoint's gonna be pretty important for all this. Okay, so we'll keep climbing. I wonder if there are any of those fissures that you can go up in more quickly. I think it's not right here. Okay, and we got something we can use to make into chocolate eventually, which is nice. Luckily, we got some fulgusin back from harvesting. Yep, kakahuatl seed. So we'll go up, recharge like this, continue climbing up. I think she actually is a little more efficient if you accelerate rather than just climbing up slowly. Either way, speed is real nice. Okay then. Those crystals might be liquid fulgusin, but I'm not quite sure. Ember core flower. Mm -hmm. Let me see here, but. I think, if you can't climb up those, but Kachina can. And that's a rock cavernous wild manifestation. Basically the same as the Geo and Animo ones, but yep, she can climb up this. Good. Okay. Which means, well, hmm. Might need to try some Night Soul Transmission. It, it's adventurous, I would say. 
has a bit of a... You know, not to be stereotypical, but a feeling of sort of going on safari. You know, very... Because they use a lot of traditional African instruments. Okay. So I'll go up. Come up here and that one was presumably down closer to the signs of the canopy then. So in that case, we should definitely activate at least one teleport waypoint around here. That's amidst the stony mountains, so there's a cave underneath that. Hmm. No, I think you're right. I wouldn't say it's not supposed to be relaxing. I think that's rather legitimate. And... Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm. Hit. Hit. And get off that and see how many more I can hit. I probably want to hit that guy. Oh, that didn't hit. That did not target that archer. That's actually really weird. Huh. So can I get up top over here or... Well, whatever. We'll break one of those, and then transmission to Milani, and that, that actually did get blocked. That's unpleasant, but not all that surprising. I blocked that too, whatever, whatever. And, mm, so now actually got burning off, that's good. We stay over here, make sure that... He continues to get hit by endless projectiles. Having to do this in such a scuffed way. Whatever. Over there. Come on. So any more? How do I want to get up here? I bet this might do it. Yeah, it will. Okay. But it does not seem like anything dropped. And now it's raining. I actually saw someone just the other day ask if there was even rain in that one, because they'd never seen any. Well, I guess there is. Okay. It was interesting how... Though I think it was mostly limited to early areas where they had more water lantern puzzles, but that it's specifically not allowed in water area... water lantern puzzle areas. Asking whether... Asking about Fontaine's rain. Okay, I could do this to look around for some game settlement of the Children of Echoes, and Rift in the Mountains, Waterlogged Ruins. That's something I don't see yet. This is the mountain with that one boss. This is the other boss. I'll just see one in the sky, and then of course the ruins down there. Let's collect uh, our rewards. But I really, really hope I can switch around soon. I will. We'll be able to. Well, and also, there's only one new character next version, so... That'll also help me catch up, but still. So... Next thing to do, I suppose, maybe, is collect specialties real quick. Sure. So we need a number of these in order to actually get her level, but some will come from her tribal chronicles, too. Uh. So this is very, very convenient. The way that specialties are shown now. We can just do it like this. That said, I'm gonna switch to this part. It would deal again for some actual real capable damage now that I'm not collecting friendship experience at the exact moment. Okay. So Milani on top. Definitely all about that surfing. So right over here, I've got one of those. She can also do a really nice sprint swim. The issue is, she can't pick that up from the water surface. Also, she definitely try to get a teleport waypoint one in the area. Thank you, thank you. 
This is a little forgiving as possible. Oh. Ideally, well, it's inevitable right now. Okay. So that's going to be it's around the spine. I wonder if. No, these are just water formed rocks. It's not like any kind of remains of some kind of being, I think. Okay. Real pretty. It is really funny seeing the placeholder desert terrain around here between Natlan and Samaru. I do wonder when they're going to add that in. So they've got to do it eventually. But wonder when the time for that will actually be. And just a couple more here and so that collection area is gone. This is going to be the fur farthest north of all of them, so we'll go there first and work our way back. Okay. Thank you. If you could just keep sprint swimming, we get very, very fast movement. Good old Alani. The consumption is real, real low. We can just keep collecting that night soul. I mean, Fugisten. Make sure we find crystals and other spots to recharge. Very, very convenient. Assume a lot more went on land, and that was the last one there, and luckily enough for us, the crystals respawn rather quickly. Jump over, get here, and more right here. Spray Feather Gill Seed, Spray Feather Gill Seed. And then Kachina needs these berries, which are... There are more of them on the map, but they're a lot more scattered around, too. Then, next one is... Get around here, next to a well. That... Well, that wasn't marked, so... Yeah, I guess... They don't mark every single one, which is part of why. Good to have a bit more in the way of abilities. Though to be fair, every not one character seems to have the passive that gives them highlighted specialties on the map, which very, very good. Which I suppose kind of compromises for the fact that their exploration passives otherwise only relate to Fulgiston, which is completely and utterly useless outside of that one. No function whatsoever. Also, it doesn't work in that one domains either, which I didn't even really think about. Yeah. And, okay, so it was there. Interesting. And can this break? That can't break, you just have to jump over. Okay. Makes sense. So we'll collect a few more of these grasses. Thank you, thank you, and it's all there. But, was another here. So now they're starting to be in ruin related areas. Okay. Continue moving over this way. Pass will actually, given that I've got to fight more of them, now is as good of a time as ever. Maybe. Come on! Uh. Oh, one just fell off. That was nice. I'll take that. So actually, the idea might be to knock them into water where they can't stand. Maybe. I wouldn't hate that. Oh, but getting on there is its own thing. Oh, you can just break those. Fine. So in that case... One, two, three, four... Goodbye. One, two, three, four. Oh, that didn't hit. One, two, three, four. And won't be collecting that chest right now. And that's certainly a way to do it. Hmm. Still need a decent amount more. It's a shame that both Kachina and Milani need the same exact materials. Definitely is a bit of an annoyance, because Kinich is going to use the Saurian Teeth, which means that he's not directly competing 
but as of right now, things are a little bothersome. Okay, that will switch back. Go in. Collect spray feather gills. And there is a... Oh! Did not know you swelled up like that. Fun, I guess. So, go over, collect remainder in here. Hello, hello. And some up there as well. Hmm. But also, of course, a place to replenish for guessing. Oh, she... She breaks on the surfboard. It's fun. Kind of... Akira bike slide type thing. So now... Went over there, but they've started to be on top here. Which means going to the ruins... Underground is going to be a good next step. But just all of these whistles that I need... That's trouble too. So we will... Return to these ruins. So there are a few more of her specialties in here. This is a nice underground lava cave. Fun stuff. Thank you, thank you. We did a quest, or part of a quest here, while we were trying to get these specialties. The day I rolled Milani. Or the night I rolled Milani. Those mushrooms, a bit like the star shrooms in the chasm, give back full gifts and points. And... It's over there, you know, we may as well take it now. No real reason to leave it. That was unlocked to buy the quest. So, oh, and... Hajime Mashtenshi, Arya Walker 09. How are you? I'm having fun. I did not mean to get off there. Okay. Come on, come on. Let's get over here. Come on, come on. See to oh right, I'm stupid, I'm stupid. That forces me onto there. I can glide across then without dying. I do not want to go onto that spirit way right now. Okay. So how then? There should be We're actually a bit farther down. That's right. No, that's actually into that. But, but, there are some down here, in a cave, a bit past this cave. I will try my best to bypass that spirit way, if at all possible. Yeah, well, that's still convenient. Right, right, I could have activated a teleport point here that I just did not bother doing. Okay, try to keep things pure while I was doing... Specialty collection, but not much of a point to that in the end, really. Okay. Stone over here. Cave over this way. At least we have that waypoint now. Okay. Collect that. Oh, and there was a chest there. This is... Not... No, this is the spot, right. So my question is, what's going to be in here? Anything special, or... No, nothing special. Sorry, I'm not buying. I also have a no soliciting rule that you would have had to see to participate in chat. I would advise you to avail yourself of that. Good luck with things. But I am not buying right now. Okay. So... Over here... And there should be a couple more up top here, right? Spray feather go where? Let's see. That air current is remained. So. It's over there, but I'm not sure if there are any paths to that. There's this, actually. There was that one, which I hadn't quite seen yet. Hmm. Spray feather kill seed. And. New collection area marked. That's also up in the Upper Sanctum. Well, as opposed to being down in the Upper Sanctum, I suppose. That wouldn't make any sense. 
Right, oh, so every time that Amber has to show up. Okay. I did not mean to kill. I feel bad now. So let's go over, collect those plants. Plant up a berries and whistles. And there are, yeah, two teleport waypoints up here. But the other one automatically activates, I believe. Let's you back in that part of the quest. Okay. And then, new collection area marked, and that's down there. So they're all just into that now. Okay, cool. And, will that enable me to survive the fall if I attack, reset? Yep, that does reset. Effective fall distance. Nice. So, wait. Where is it? Either way, let's activate this quickly. Thank you. Got that back and wait. He's over here, I think. Got a couple of the warriors, a couple of stories too. Okay, well. No time like the present. You down and get the burning started. Thanks. And dig away. And hit. Fight. Good damage. Good EM. Fight. Good fire over there. And oh, nice. Well, that got them all. Fun. Wooden whistle and the fangs. Given the indwelling. Given the fact that when we have commissions that have us fight the warriors, it says they're looking for sparring matches instead of, oh, they're trying to kill people. I would presume that we're not killing them when we fight them. I hope not. I actually kind of like them. And bye. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Come on. Luckily, we can keep this going for Actually, given that mm, damage is still leaving a little bit to be desired, uh, definitely need talent levels, HP boosted, well, whatever. Human enemy will go down decently to Melania, I guess, but to be fair, can just use Emily here. Thanks, burn, and vaporize. Come on, come on. Give me whistles. And nice. If we can get burning, the damage is quite good, but if. Okay. We're there, Milani. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're there for a bit more collection. Oh, we got a secret source automaton. I should try fighting that thing. So they get stronger when the characters of Night Soul active. They do a special attack, that is. I just want to fight one of you. Okay, so that's that down there. She's in Night Soul's blessing, which means they're absorbing stuff now. They decrease all their resistances by a very significant amount. And, come on, come on. And, oh goodness. We need to... Well, they're just very strong. Alright. Fair enough. Put that down, and you will recharge all that. Yep, get it back up. Go back into laser mode. Take the reses down, and oh goodness. How about you don't just kill me like that? That would be real nice for me. Okay, not so burst triggered, but also... It's down. And oh well... That's a dead dealer. Come on. And burn and hit. And was it Kachina who finished that? I don't think. Okay. So. That's a material I haven't had gotten before. Now defunct secret source automaton. She the secret source. Appears to be the mechanism by which the secret source automaton was powered, but its core is now empty. And yeah, axis component that was used to connect two mechanisms. I'll leave that. Yeah. Let's collect a bit more, get Michael Giston back. Eventually, I'll need to 
bring Duluk back to life. And there are actually a few more spots. At least one more spot than I got. Hmm. Over here, and I think a quest is a bit nearby. There's at least one NPC around here. They're in a lot of places. Last spot is going to be over here, then. Actually, I think there was one more? One more, maybe? Okay. Heal up real quick. And... Oh, it's over there. Huh. I guess we could activate that waypoint. Coming from the main would actually be a good way to get there fast. And I suppose I'll collect a bunch of the silly Kachina berries. That down there. Thank you. Quite a little, but you can see she stays and Night Soul State there. Didn't really need to do that. And. Could get back now, but actually. I need more mats. Best way to do that, gonna be knocking them into the water. Knock and. Oh my goodness. Can I. Oh, please. One, two. Oh, come on. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And, well, that. Yep, that did it. Cool. And cheese tactics don't always work, but when they do, they're pretty good. So, we will come up here and. Well, right, right. That won't work. Come on, I did not mean to do that. Luckily, right, that just knocks you away, cool. Okay. So take a quick teleport from here, get that one. Teleport waypoint two, I suppose, and then go hunting, I would say. Really, really do want to level them as much as I can while I can. Hello there. Now we uh, this down and hit and blast. Keep the burning up. Thank you. Well, of course, the Yukasaurus warriors are not really the ones where I want to use dendro damage anyway. At least on the Yukasauruses themselves. Because of their dendro resistance. Don't have any. Great way to shred that other than deep wood. I mean, we'll win, but still. And keep that burning up. Get a few more whistles. Come on. And that should proc and blast. Oh, the actual fire damage self killed it, which makes sense because it yep. would be taking a lot less from the actual dendro. Mm -hmm. So we can at least level up these talents now. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wave momentum damage bonus. Base damage, additional damage bonus for surging bite. And it just makes her really, really strong. I think we can hit over there. Thank you. Probably get the mining one for today. Yep, cool. That waypoint in the last couple of spray feather gills. Thank you, thank you. Get some corn. That over there should be my way to. Oh, we got more of you guys. Okay, cool. Thanks. Guess you guys will use. First, thanks. Thank you, Emily. Also, we can use that to keep up burning, I guess. Now that that's really the issue here. Thank you, and it's one wooden whistle. Okay. Hmm. You should be the waypoint I need. Jump. And it's over here. Okay. And some got a cave. Interesting. And that. Oh, that just leads out the side over there, so nothing particularly notable. Oh, but there's a monitor. Here's some jingling. 
That's also some good damage. Should maybe bring them out? I don't quite know where it is. Is there basically not one's equivalent of Seelie's? Should be around here somewhere. We'll find it eventually. Alright. Come on, come on. Hmm. And of course, Monitu is a Native American term for basically the creator or a god kind of kind of thing. Okay. I think it might be a sort of kami type figure, which I suppose in that case would make the Seelies be a decent comparison. And the Seelies are themselves references to fairies. Okay. So in that case, well I should condense some resin too. But, but, that's right, we can get few more levels of Milani's talents. Though, to be fair, her normals don't need leveling up at all. It's all in burst and e-skill. Oh, goodness. That... What do you mean, busted? You know, sort of fall down wrong and pop a cheek or something? Now that that that's what I said back in high school once where I felt bad on my butt. Everyone was worried and I say, don't worry, I didn't pop a cheek or anything. It's just but imagine if you could do that. You just fall down hard on your butt and you hear it deflate like a balloon. It's the sad sputtering sound. Oh, I got a new chair, by the way. For anyone who needs to know. Because my previous setup was really, really stupid. It was literally a piece of paper on a wooden chair. A piece of brown paper, and the reason the brown paper was there was so that when I put down my guitar amp on top of it... Okay, well... I'm not sure whether that makes me more or less worried then. Because on one hand, that shouldn't be dealing that much damage to you. So if it does, that raises more and more frightening questions. Got a couple berries in here. I think that didn't show that. So we'll move over this way. Dot. Dot? K dot? Kendrick Lamar? I only know that because of my one friend who really likes Kendrick. DOT? Dead on time? Dead on arrival? That might be more of a dis better description than that I might like. Canopy of the Cliff Tops. Let's see. Not long. Canopy of the Cliff Tops, Kawadapak Mountain, settlement of the tribe who live alongside the Yumkasaurs. Sister suspended giant trees here with a rope's grappling hex, hence the name, Sons of the Canopy. Okay. So, I guess we'll activate that and. Berries are down here in this. Whittle Valley. Okay, don't worry. Thanks for popping in. Have fun with stuff. That, it tends to. Either way, I hope you have a pleasant evening. If that's where it is where you are. And, okay, more berries. Going up. Thank you. Good stuff. Yep, always. Okay, so this is a good way to get... Where I need to be, because it's mostly around here then. So Fulgiston. Alright. Switch to Kachina. And the berries are around here. Where else? Some over that way. Hmm. So Fulgiston for a bit of nice fast movement. Lovely, lovely. Plant up a berry. Nice watery berries. Okay. Let's go east from here. And southeast. 
There was... It's a big impact crater over here that I think leads into a cave eventually. I'm wondering how that is going to work. We'll see. And we're in a sprint, so we can switch over to Kachina just like that. How nice. And hopefully should get specialties around here. And this seems to be connected to that temple. Oh, this is okay. And the Montu is over there. Yumkasu related stuff. I wonder if that fish... That did not seem to do anything in particular. Huh. Leads into... Underground area. One of a couple. Yep, just right over there amidst the stony mountains. Should be right, it was behind this wall. Now... I go back over this way. There are a lot more berries around than Milani's grasses. It helps that the berries always come in bunches of three. Oh, hey, well, all right. This. Okay, they're not in here. They look like they are, but they actually aren't. Classic. So we will continue on our merry way. Get a few more berries that did not show up like that. Wonder where they would ever show up at all, and okay, another wild manifestation. Huh. Other way, nice and fast here, and that full gets in back, and the impact crater that I mentioned earlier is around over there in that direction. Okay. So very Yumkasur oriented area. Seems to me. And, well, it's raining now. Okay. Take this, and... Collection area marked, and they're starting to get up top here. So, we can mark that teleport waypoint. Collect that. Good idea to do. At least eventually. Oh, and that... Master Trainer Warrior's Challenge. Was all renowned and was to train and own their stream. Where there are those who train will be trainers. Challenges of varying difficulty for those who wish to pass themselves. Hot as possible during challenges, obtain greater rewards. Master trainers, three tiers of rewards readied. Oh, that's cool. Maybe I'll try one of those right now. Try the Spirit Ways. Huh. Spirit Way Challenge here. Might as well give it a whirl. Let's be. I'm gonna prep. Use Moani for this. Or a Kaholosaur. So. Full light targets, challenge coins, full light rips, full light weeping, coal source, or use a character from people that springs to start the challenge. Message your limits, collect them for points, destroy them. Fissures to be avoided, lose points if you touch them for a certain distance. Alright. So. Through the fire and flames. Can't believe this is literally Dragon Force. Okay. Couple of coins. Thank you. Bite. Fun stuff. And... Bite. Get the coins. Let's try to get a perfect on here. Ah, oh, we can do that in midair too. Nice. Epic Moani moment. Fun. I bite. So that sustains us in the air a little. And bite. Jump. Go over. Jump. Bite. Bite. And get nice and fast. Jump, bite. I wonder if we got everyone so far. I don't imagine S requires a truly perfect score, but I still want to go for it. Get teleport waypoint. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And did I. Nice. Seem to be leaning it on the tracking on that. Bite. Might be a bit late sometimes, and jump, bite, one, two, bite, and alright. So I think, okay, we got every single coin, destroyed every single target. New record, 10,300 SS. That was big. Let's check one more time. Spearway challenge, and... 
Yeah. B A S S S. Perfect score. Fun stuff. Okay then. Just collect all these rewards then. Sure. And any mighty challenging spirit lane winter's objects generate along the paths formed by spirit ways. As many full out orbs or destroy as many full out targets as you can. So that if you do so, something good might happen. Jump while running to avoid rifts and other dangers. Might weep to weep even further. Nice. So the timer was not actually score related at all. Okay. Huh. Well, still got to go up this way. And that was a cool thing to just stumble upon. I like that. Really just have a lot of fun things to just chance upon. That would need a grappling hook or a yumkasaur. I'm waiting for Kinich to actually use any of those. Let's go up top. Oh, but I'm pretty sure the teleport waypoint is down there instead. Maybe. Navigate. It'll come up when I'm close enough anyway, so... I think I'll be fine. Jump. This one cool down, though, is the thing. Yep, it was down there somewhere. Oh, well. Oh, it's literally just right down there. Okay. And just like that. Let's see what it says here in the Ancestral Temple. Temple of Ancient Four Bears. How many bears? Four of them. Okay, geography. Not long, Temple of Ancient Four Bears, long, long ago. There was an age when the earth refused to accept seeds, when flowers were weathered and people could no longer turn to the land for sustenance. Instead, the ancestors of that ancient era turn to the gods of night for guidance. Huh. You know, whatever works. I'm gonna mark something on the map real quick for later. To see down in this area eventually. Well, that'll be for later. As in, next patch. Occasion of something eventually. Okay, well, you can involve it. And grapple where? Can. Ah, uh, okay. Can get that double jump going unless, well, okay. Well, that is actually kind of nice. So, comes back here. Spores of repose. So that's one. Double jump, basically. Uh, oh, well, okay. Huh. They don't seem to take as much fall damage, which is good. Still. And they're actually level 100. They're stronger in theory than anything I can put out myself. That's fun. And double jump. Packed in. So that grapple. That's a good grapple. Let's just see real quick. And. Okay, well. Huh. You know what? Let's just try fighting them with the Yunkasaur. Oh, so they got a two hit combo. Fun. Well, alright. Kill your baby. It works. The big thing is that it does actually apply elements. That's fun. So that's one way to get another element in party, in theory. Huh. And... Can I get a... Functions of it similar to Kinyich, actually, which is funny. And... Hmm. We actually got stuck on there. We'll just stunlock you against here. Can't even see you anymore. Fair enough. You know, if someone just looked, I wondered. Without context, I wonder what they think would be going on here. I wonder if they can even crit, actually. It's an interesting question. So... 
And scroll. Come up. And use that to get a little bit more forward. Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. Put you down. And... Emily moment. Thank you. Okay. Cool, and that was nice and simple to get, actually. Oh, Monitu there. Huh. Where are you trying to go? Well, for in the area, I guess we may as well figure out where you're headed. Oh, because you're headed to that graffiti over there. Well, oh wait. More berries. And more berries. Big target kind of thing over there, and I wonder where that is. Queen of a berry. A teleport waypoint up somewhere, maybe up top of there. Huh. Thank you, Kachina. Yep, it's up top all the way over there. We will keep on climbing. That will help us get around. Cool. Ameka. Ameka. Couple more. Clean up a bearings. They should be moving a bit more towards the north now. Okay. And, yep. Just over here, and there are a few in. Flame granite tree roots. Interesting. But, should not be all that many more. We need. Yep, we got a bunch. Okay. Collect the rest on the map right now, but Kachina should not need more. Many kills we'll get from Milani. Need for money we can get from for Travel Chronicles. So nothing is really in serious issue. One way or the other. Keep on moving. Over here. Thank you. Uh -uh. Over this way. And that. Probably a sword and claw succulent. That's it. They're both in there, okay. Cool. Get up top over here then. Would mean. Yep. Can jump high enough to get back on the water, but it doesn't really matter if lose. What are you? Oh, okay. A wizard's all came out. Crabs and a chess. Lots of things just. With this big pheasant stuck in the ground. That's silly. Monitude's heading all the way over there then. Not my problem. And new collection area and it's all in. No, there were a couple in here. Okay. This underground-ish area. Not truly underground, but... Hmm. Go over here. That challenge was real fun. And inside the cave. Let's see how I should get there through here. Through here. Okay. Actually, Milani. And ah, uh, can't dash, but Milani, thank you and. Hello, Pyro Crystal Flies. It's the end of that, so we'll go into that area there. Should be good. Another warrior. Take you down. Hello, then. And... The burning up. Cool. Cool. Keep those scents going. Wait for this. Thanks. Simple enough. It's just one wooden whistle. Huh. Oh well. Suppose I'll live. Down over here is going to be a cave entrance of one to find. It'd be fun if she had a special plunge. It'd be fun if all of them had special plunges. Can't ask for that much though. There are going to be a couple more in here. Thank you, thank you. Okay, come on. That's down in this area. Huh. Right, right, and there was one more to proc here. And clean up the 
Activate this. Take this. Okay. Collection of all recommended areas completed. And now we have more than enough for what Kachina needs. Okay. Now it's all about the whistles. To be fair, it also is for Milani. And I guess we could go around and look for more. Take down Soraform Travel Warriors. Sulfurous Veins. Past that. Past those little Saurians. May as well collect some of these succulents if they're around here. Kimich will need these later. Come on. Oh, and that's Children of Echo stuff. She can just go over them. Collect them that way and... Oh, what? I... Uh-oh. Is that a wild? Yep, there's a wild just on the other side. Come on. So we'll get down here. Thank you. Just like this. Oh, so since we already destroyed... Took out this encampment. The chest actually stays unlocked. Interesting. Not have expected that. In that case, why not? I guess I'll just collect it. Oh, no space left in the inventory. Whatever. That means... Sathos is going to eat. Oh, well, hello. Hopefully we can get a level from that. Ooh, nice. Almost ready, but to be fair, nothing will make him good. Okay. Thank you. And... Come on, come on. By going in... Oh! The yellow obsidian fragment is from there. Oh, interesting. That's fun. Obsidian fragment with engraved patterns style like those of the children of Echoes, which you obtain by chance while exploring. For using three of them, though what that will achieve, you cannot tell. So that was just... Yep. They were just from especially large enemy encampments, it seems. Cool. Either way, it seems as if... At least some of the fights you have with... Saurian Wars are more they challenge you on sight, not to kill you, but... They just like fighting. Interesting. Not unprecedented. I see it flying around that cloud, but... I have fought you enough times for the moment, at least. So, not right now. Here, here. Over this way. Thank you, Kachina. Go back up. Bring those night soul points back. Hmm. And should be another teleport waypoint around here. Let's see. Well, also just some Saurian warriors to fight. Hmm. And a Saurian to fight. I really don't think we're killing them if these are just Saurian warriors lying around. But this one did relock itself, so I suppose that indicates. What kind of chest they are? Maybe? Maybe. Who knows? And get a couple. Uh, and it did spread the fire successfully, which is also quite nice. Come on, come on. And keep them burning up. And maybe hit. Sure. Okay. Which means we need to put fire back on you. Thanks. Okay. Gonna keep on hidden, and the vector they've got is really, really good, too. Wasn't surprise. And there you are. Cool. Mm. Look at that. Do you wonder, Tyrant's Fang, Sharp Tooth, fell from a mighty knot on the story. I'm surprised I haven't gotten any of those yet. Spreaded Edge, for some shape, attested the Frosty, its own battle, among many swords of Knotlon. One of such a tooth must have been a ruthless tyrant indeed. Huh. Couple more of those. They don't show nearly all of the encounters here. Warukunai. Warukunai. You're all the way over there. Hmm. Okay. 
so then still can't huh. huh. yeah, grinding well I mean crafting would definitely help a bit but still we it's tough here still beetle oh that's eroding avatar of lava awesome we can keep going with some nice hits, but oh well, among other things, we can burning up with a nice rapid application. Also, just good damage. Yeah, these are the ones that just instantly die when they take it up pyro app. Yeah, yeah. We'll probably just kill it beforehand. Yeah. Oh well. United Stone, United Seed of Life. Huh. Like that. United Seed of Life, condensed pile and burning matter obtained from the body of a defeated avatar of lava. It's a slight heat attempting to stop a stone pile of this size from burning away. Incessantly burning away would be a hard task indeed, so this is some primordial form of a life. Shard obtained from the body, United Stone. It was shattered to a great extent. On the inside, it still continues to burn. It's meant to the extraordinary vitality of Forgiston. Hmm. Down here should be another group of warriors. Okay. Ah, uh, Kahola sort of warriors. Fun. So then, another, and hit, and Emily. Take this. Cool. And hit. Oh, goodness. Hit. He's not burning up. And who needs this? Raichi the Thaw. The Raging Earth. And a couple more, a couple more. And a good amount of the golden ones, actually. Is it interesting? So another chest, and. Oh, it dropped food items, too. Oh, Saurus crackers. Oh, so it dropped the recipe along with what you need to make it. It's actually really cool. Okay. And now, this is the proof we needed that not one is back to just the game producing peak. Because we haven't had just random recipe drops in treasure chests since 1.0. Literally. Because more meat and some other things came from chests. Mushroom pizza came from a random chest in Storm Terror's lair. We're so back. We're so back. I... Probably it behoove me to try to craft some of those whistles up a little. They all need slightly higher tier ones now. Do they? Yeah, they do. Okay. Huh. How many of the iron ones we can get? Warriors. Not refund, but double product is what we need. Okay. Focus on upskilling as much as possible, though actually the ascension is the real key. Greatest guide, okay. Some slight bonus to her burst damage. Okay. Then we need some gold ones now. Hmm. Maybe. We might be able to make that work. Five of the gold ones. And if we're lucky, we could get a double result. Maybe. We weren't lucky. Oh well. So. Time to continue. Mm -hmm. So, more of the warriors are over that way down in that encampment. It is interesting that all of them have the icon of the Geo ones. Though to be fair, that's almost definitely necessary. Oh, we have a mixed encampment. No, no, it is all animal ones. I mean, Hydro ones. Whatever. Come on, it. Did, did they interrupt? They did interrupt my attack. Oh, that's ridiculous. I hate it here. 
Come on, come on. Hit and... Oh, goodness. You want the Totsugeki? Actual Guilty Gear. Come on, come on. Thank you, thank you. Go ahead, go ahead. And how many more? Ah, oh, goodness. If I'm burning... No, really, that poise damage is... Something insane. Please, please. Get me down here and... Oh, what? Get to a place where we can actually do stuff too. Thanks. Yeah, so long it even went down a level. It's real annoying. Thank you. Luckily, the homing is actually incredible. And hit. Maybe. Okay. Such as. Where's the metal whistle? Some of this. Chronicle of the Dream Secret Priest, Angakuk, Angakuk, call forth the winds, then take both my hands, and with feverish fervor, then pass through the gaps between the blazing flames. If you can hear me, but why up? Take my hands and in them place the fruit, the ripened fruit, to serve as a testament. Oh? Huh, oh! This is the ripened fruit. A truly comical number of Sensetias. That's funny. It... This is a good one. It's a real good one. Get another of the big ones. Mm -hmm. Okay. Over here, which... So we may as well activate this one. We're gonna be kind of in the area. This? Fire Thief's Secret Isle. Huh. That... Not another unmarked... It's another unmarked island. And they really just said, let's do things like 1.0 again. And they were incredibly wise for it. Oh, but if I tried to go there, it seems to be shrouded in mist. Try to go there now, what would happen? Come on. Thank you. Put that back and... Couple of sore form warriors over here, but we can drop one in right now. Oh well, we can try. Come on. One, two, three, four. It's one down. Oh goodness. And well, you almost knocked yourself into the water. Almost. There we go. Just a wooden whistle. And someone else. One more of you guys. Oh, a couple more of you guys. Well, okay. Thanks. Hit and that's Emily's turn. Actually, there. Someone got the power off them. Won't let that stay. Come on, come on. Make sure it stays on everyone. No. Come on, come on. Oh, goodness. Someone should not be taking this many hits. Duke is not as durable as I'd like him to be for this. And, alright. Thanks. Give me a better whistle, please. I'm begging you. Good old Emily. And, there we are. Give me a good whistle. Really? Huh. That... For a second, I thought that might be... One of the rings for people, the springs, and actually- oh, it actually was. Okay, cool. Azure Obsidian Fragment. Great patterns, stuff like those are the people, the springs. And by chance, achieve, unlock. Something which I believe contains an artifact elixir. That's the board for the area, I believe. So, let's continue. Alright. Activate that waypoint, which... I believe, not to say too much, but I believe Shilin's boss is going to be around here. Yeah, I think. So, we jump, go up, get the waypoint. Thank you. Oh, I did not mean to do that. That is not what I intended to do. Can I abandon that challenge? I bet I could. Oh. How hard does this go and... Let's go to... Pyro Sigil? No. Huh. 
probably meant to be Yunkasaur type stuff, maybe? I don't know. Oh, but it, we had Fulgissin on us. Okay. Some of that damage, but... Not my concern at the moment. Hmm. I will simply... Go down this way. I want to see if I can even get to that aisle. My Yonko waters, and... I think... This is going to detonate, and... Open up a little cavern, which will fight a new boss. Okay. This is why there's a teleport waypoint so close to. So, let's see if we can get to the secret aisle at all. How they might try to stop us. Hello there. Interesting. Just the way of damage there, but what do you really expect? Yeah, big hydro pass. It. Huh. That totally missed. Okay. Nothing to do then, but let's see what happens if we go to the Fire Thief Secret Isle. Challenge failed? Yeah. Okay. Hi, hi. We can do that. That yeah, girl. Let's do some nice semi perpetual surfing. That Night Soul transmission going to. So actually. Oh, we can go there, except they shoot at me. Alright. Venture to a secret aisle. Clearly, it's gonna shoot me as soon as I open up and probably kill Deal Hook. Venture to a secret aisle. Oh, puny people, oh, power hunger base. What price are you willing to pay? What sacrifice will you make for that which you covet? Wacky. Dodge, and... Teleport waypoint. Only the training grounds are left. Why arrive at the ancient lost trial site? Huh. So, just disable that. Now, what would happen if everything here before... People the spring stuff... Also... Okay, so Yumkasaurs are involved here. I see. Grapple. Grapple. Oh. Well, goodbye. Achievement for a dead Zorian. Thank you for accompanying us on our journey. Oh, goodness. So then. Kinich would be nice to have here, but. Oh, okay. This is meant to be done with a Yumkasaur specifically. Hmm. Grapple around here. Oh, you can climb up like that, and that's fun. Disable that. Grapple. 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 And... Oh, well. Okay. So, we... Grapple, even without anything to grapple to. Strafe around. Head up top, disable that, and... Hello there. That's gonna be on here. Touch that, and one of those lit up. Hmm. Yeah, what kind of special dot are we going to get when we do weighted quests if we've already done everything in here? Shame these Yungasaurs are pretty slow. Hmm. Should trial site. Well, that'll do it. Goodbye. That's over there, so what kind of... Seems like a Polisaur related. Probably. But... Let's see. Place of where to start this. Hmm. Well, whatever. Transmission probably around here, so probably one people of the springs trial one. Yep, so there's one right there. Let's were you on the land. That'd be nice. Oh well. Get up here. Can't reach me. Hey, get on land, why don't you? And oh well, that that'll do it. Guess it's time to heal up real quick. 
Okay. Really? Just... What would happen if... Collected everything of note on that island before... People the Spring Story Quest. Which is basically a Milani Story Quest too. Okay. Head get over here. Hi. And highly territorial. As you would expect from a literal reptile. No homing at all. Okay. Wait for you to lose your elemental aura. Thank you. Thank you. And alright, just like that. And then start the burning. Thank you. And great as always. Burn is continually nicely. Thank you. And cool, cool. Good AoE. Very, very fun. And some drops. But of course, we'll use Moani herself for the challenge. Okay. That's for the challenge, and. Right, it's just shutting down. Oh, okay. Alright. Just strafe a bit better than it. Wow. That was. rather sad. Okay, so move nice and fast, and. Oh, we got high winds. Interesting. Cannot disable, and. That's everything? Maybe. There should be a inscription then. Okay, it's right over there. Can't I jump that? Annoying. Come on, come on. And a chest and one more inscription. Should mean at least one Children of Echoes trial. Over click this. And then it's a jump we can take. Okay. Big jump, thank you. Nice. Only the people at the springs can make a jump like that. Okay. Hmm. What other trial and where then? Be around here. Yep, Geo Trial. Probably gonna walk a final trial then. Maybe. My question is actually actually a pyro crystal fly. What kind of pure elemental life forms from pyro energy? Pyro. Free and is bound as the butterflies of Brazil, glittering pyro creature, rising condensing elements, feeds off ubiquitous power of pyro. Fuse the inhabitants of the Serenity Pot with his own passion, while with companion among the animals. That's cute. Did that open that, actually? May have. Let's run the challenge and. Oh, it's climbing up. We'll guess in. Sort of moving around rapidly. Oh, well, okay. Huh. Enter the rift. Oh, fun. That. Blows them up. Interesting. What are the purpose of that was then? We're going over here. Oh, it just automatically avoided them. That's all that did. So now it's going to be one final challenge, it seems. Presumably combat. They just shot at me pointlessly. That's fine. So, thing over here or not? Mm -mm, well, there are a number of ores to collect, and that's quite nice. Hmm. That would be fair. The challenge itself is its own animal. Cool. Move over. Grab a couple more. It's actually not that bad at mining. Not amazing, but not bad. And another hit. Cool. Go over, finish off that final challenge, and see what happens. I do wonder what it's going to be, specifically. I'm very, very close to the edge. 
some cattle cow mushrooms. Let's go. Get a little bonus because the Kachina's harvesting passive too, I think. I guess stamina regeneration though is a little annoying, and of course, can't use that to look around at all because no map. Okay. This is where the people of the springs challenge was. Then, of course, Sons of the Canopy was over there, too. Switch to Milani. Grab a few more of these. Stuff that's around. And that's just an elemental particle. Okay. Huh. of Waddle Seed. We got you. Hello. One, two, three, four, and... Put that back. One, two, three, four. Okay. And that's all the focus that I had. Okay. Actually, if I use a Yunkasaur here, how many. There's one sigil over there. Okay. Scrabble up then. Nice range. I wonder if that's more range than a four leaf sigil. I would bet it is. At least a little. Okay. Go up there. Track with the final challenge and see what it is. Cool little area. Get a couple more of the Pyro Crystal Flies. They decided to come back to me. How nice of them. So Kachina, go up here, I'm climbing, two, three, and switch, see whatever's going on here, because it's got to be combat. Oh, it's a wild manifestation. Okay, cool. Pull your swift wild manifestation. All right, then. And, ooh, big laser. Oh. And, come on, night soul. Damage is boosted significantly. And bite, vaporize, and oh wow. Is the shield coming or the shield is definitely coming. I don't like that, that's not good. Oh bad, bad, bad. Well, at least we can burn you. Come on, I Okay. Ah, oh, annoying. Yep, we could not take you down fast enough to prevent you from using special stuff. Oh wow. Thank you. And... Hmm. Hit, and now it's stunned, and a lot of particles just came back. Which means... Well... Not much there. Don't think it used its dual zone again. I hope not. And... Annoying. Thanks. So what? Okay. Come on, you! And... Ah, uh, really? This is stupid. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I... It's gonna be annoying, that's for sure. And... Hit. Interesting that here we... And... Dashing through helps. We set it on fire once, and that's... Decent enough. Yeah, it's not proccing another burning reaction, because it's got... Perfect pyro, basically. There's your shield, whatever. Come on. We need more energy. So that's done. It'll stun you. Get that back for us. Luckily, you don't have healing. That's good. Oh! Huh. So that only happens if you actually break the shield while it's in manifestation in its trial form. How would a brute force this guy is actually evil? Come on. And bite. Ooh, nice. Okay, so it breaks a good deal every time. Okay. And. Okay, cool. Thank you. So we'll let this go. Did it manage to break it? And I'm not sure it'll ever do that again now. At least not during this fight. I really hope it doesn't. Please. Please. Keep that burning going, keep that burning going, and finally. Oh, it's more. Okay. Alright. 
I should have expected as much. Luckily, we've got much better ways to do all these wild manifestations, but... Oh, come on. One, two, and... Oh, please. Uh, Alright. Can I... Do you okay? Oh, never mind. Never mind. So damage is not great for this. And there is your shield. Okay, alright. Oh, goodness. This... It's probably the team I have being Garbo for this, but it's not easy. Huh. So we got health restoration food. Hmm. Might want to bring somebody back to life. Probably. We'll give you shrimp sushi. There you go. Get a couple more cheese breads. Okay. All right, and mm, come on, please, I beg of you. This will I'll take down that shield then. Okay, it's cool how they're very, very regimented in terms of the areas there. Okay, come on, come on, thanks, and come on, keep going with the burning, 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 and keep going until we can actually stop your trial. Uh, thanks. Okay. Cool. And, uh, but it's damage, not about anything else is the thing. That's the trouble. So we'll be able to get their shields in slowly, but sure, this is taking way longer than it should, just because actual metal damage is not really my forte right now. Come on. Come on. So we can feed you. Take this slow and steady. Very slow and very steady. Two and come on. Put down you and Oh, what was that attack? Was that supposed to just be physical or Oh come on. Two and out of the way that. One. Oh please. The greater which is just geometric is nice. Every time the shield gets less annoying to a very minor specific extent. Stupid, stupid Wyob. Stupid. Come on, come on. Hey, what's Virgin got actually? Eh, that didn't do much. Okay. Eh. Oh, please. But. The more it ticks down, the better. To be fair, probably get trial characters for this. It's probably how Clone Book's supposed to do it. Probably. Whatever. And, alright, that broke that shield. Come on. One, two, three, four. One. Two. But, physical wild is. Interesting, though, to be fair, I would bet it's this on whether they're in their trial form or not. Okay, cool. Burn that, take you down. Thanks. So, I guess it's in the trial form that they're this sort of regimented. It would make sense. And there's that. Annoying. The question is just how much? How much is it going to take? How many before it works for me again. Oh. Well, whatever. And finally, finally. Okay. And Emily's got it. Hopefully we can take a few of you down like this. I'm praying. Go for the person who's got burning on them. I'm begging you. Please, please. Just go for the go for the kill. And finally that's another wild down. Okay, and probably do that for continuance, and, well, there we are. Okay. Thankfully, this should hopefully help. Shield is definitely a lot weaker now. Put you down, and... Yeah, this should help. Okay. Time to just dodge the rest. It's interesting that it's the Geo way of that deals physical damage. Makes sense as Geo is basically gold and physical a lot of the time, but still. 
And it may have taken forever. We did it. Oh, now the sun's about. That's fun. This. It's been aura heroes wit and oh, iridescent inscription fragment. Hmm. She would have gotten it from another of the quests too. Fragment of a shattered iridescent inscription is broken beyond repair, can no longer serve its purpose. Dismissed by many as delusional obsession. Some still believe they hold the key to unraveling messages from ancient civilizations. Alright. Oh, and once you clear that out, it actually appears on the map. Oh, that's yep. fun. Okay. My question is, if we came here during story quest, would it look, would it look different? It have a different appearance and aspect to it? Because it was connected to the story quest events instead, or would we have to do the little adventure thing? Or either way, that... It's cool they just let us do that. We were able to just find our way there and do a few fun little challenges. Including with that stupid, stupid way on. Alright. So here we are. Put you down. Well, Death Rod. And cool. Well, so you got Vaporize on you, which means you can damage a good deal, except for the fact that a lot of you just have crazy amounts of stuff going for some ridiculous reason. Come on. Really, really? Go ahead, Dali. And let's just put Emily down here. Thanks. And thanks. Oh, please. Keep hitting and keep that burning up on you. I wonder how access that Curtain Valley ended. That open key is somewhere. I would find practically everywhere, anywhere. Practically anywhere. And it could be another ring? Or not in this case. It's one key to somewhere. Hmm. Get us somewhere, found practically anywhere. Still can't ascend right now. And Sheena can't ascend right now either. Hmm. So in that case. Well, they're not up top there though. Oh, but right, there was that chest. Again, if it's there, I may as well get it. No reason to really hold back if I'll be. Coming back through eventually just to kill everything. Yeah, let's take it. Thank you. Okay. And. Next ones are. Oh, current bounty has ended. So there are a bunch around, but they just. don't actually highlight that many. Huh. That's. Kind of lame. Warriors are not on six great tribes, but the honor glory of their people. And long here is a living fun. Long set sword companions from warriors acquire their traits. How to apply them on the field of battle. Hmm. I could go and take down a few more. I think I will. Or at least I can level Milani. A little bit more. We'll see. Bonus production, low probability. You can make not that many. Okay. Those wilds were wild. That level of DPS test is not something I was expecting to encounter. We need a couple more hydro gemstones. Alright. A couple more of the chunks, that is. So, Melania Ascension, let's do it. And there we are. 80 of those. And there we go. And we also get 
one more blue thing right now. Fun. 80. Level 80 is good. Decent enough. Toss one onto standard banner. That'll take us to how much? Take us to 33 pity on the normal banner. Okay. And, okay, purple. Not bad. And that's... Okay, I guess. Nothing all that special. And we'll feed it to the other one. Find that, and... Kachin can kind of use it, but Lion Spank is actually better on her. Interestingly enough... Okay. So... I suppose I could go looking for a few more. Open up that interactive map and scour the land clean. Relatively. But... The route we're basically supposed to take to people that springs essentially this route. Hmm. I I will actually progress things in lava, and then after that I can figure out some garbage with trying to boost them up even more. But it's fun to find that island. A true merchant's trumpet joins the night wooden wars alongside some seasoned veterans after the tournament. Wani moots the idea of visiting people of the springs. Okay. And we are in still in focus experience mode. Oh, well. Go along this pathway. Hmm. This is where. Starts being sort of Yumkasaur related territory. Get my focus in back. Okay. Said, get our transmission back. We should always switch in order to ensure that we can use as little focus as possible. Try to keep that going. Since refreshing is kind of hard. Wait until. Transmission fills itself back up. Okay. It's over there. Punish our Fulgiston. Through here. Thank you. And a Monitu in that wing. Hmm. Well, alright. It's not entirely abnormal. This is where we fought a group of Saurian warriors. That's right. Get back up. Come back up here, get climbing, get some wheat. Keep on moving. Thank you. Get back around this teleport waypoint. And yep, this is the pathway we're supposed to take down to people of the springs. There's obsidian totem I will be able to use to get a little bit of reputation stuff going. Just a little. Go down here. Transmission back up. And once that starts running out, we'll switch it back in. Run over. It respawns that. Despawns that turbo truly in favor of a different turbo truly. This is the most efficient way to travel using Kachina, I would say. Except. Didn't entirely work. Oh, here you are. Hello. No, put you down here. Hello. Shouldn't be much in the way of trouble. Yeah, it's not as if they're trying to kill us. It's just they like a good fight and they see us and they sort of, you know, it would give me a good fight, that guy. Okay. So we're going to move onward and again actually continue the quest line. Head back, get my Fulgiston back. This is where I was supposed to meet up with Milani again. Okay. Switch back to Kachina. Okay, so there is a 
spirit way over there, it seems. Also a teleport waypoint. Fun. And we also have viewpoint. Home of hot springs and flowing waters. I think there's a Melusine around here visiting, actually. Check our geography. Not one. Toyok Springs, tribe who lives alongside the Koloa Sort was known as the people of the springs, renowned for their hot springs and relaxing music among all the tribes. This is the most popular among visitors from afar. And they're basically supposed to be Hawaiians. Milani is specifically a Hawaiian name. Yatta, Suetazo, finally here at home, Milani. Have a look around. Ryosenoshu. Resting on surfboards. So the Hawaiians did invent surfing. Or at least are generally credited <laughs> as the inventors of surfing. Morava, Suran de Dirato. Did the hot springs after battles is the best in Sakati Bara. Bottle of wine, would you? Take it a chodai, taheta, a makamo. Another early in the day, isn't it? Golden dust, tanga. Mirsa, vacation? Amazing. Why, we're going to hear some kind of holiday going on. A matsuri? Every day like a holiday around here, every day we're celebrating. Show you around, where to start. Tokagai mm. kokana? Zochi Kwikado Records, Koncha Plaza. Some of the options, real highlight around here. Try the springs. Yep, exactly. Natural hot springs, onsen dayo. Benefits soak, guaranteed a good night's sleep. Want us to bathe here? Okay. And don't be shy to get a change. And new travel outfit. Morani? Atea. And that's Ate Obasan. Ate is fine, the candle keeper. But it was you. Fun, fun haircut. Two to the hot springs. That's right, introduce you. Travel in Paman. Just rub now one, taking around your experience customs. Maroshkana, hello, and you are. The neighbor. Were you also continue during the pilgrimage? That's true. Otomari-san. Yet the neighbor. It's close to winning. The next door person, basically. Too surprising, always been strong, not true, really. On the past, can take these two, dip in the onsen. Talk to you later, need swimsuits, find something lying around the shop, go look. Okay. Outfit for the cutscene. Rule about bathing. Remaining. A rule. Here for first time, sir. So I just have complete a trial artificial to put on natural ones. Make sure we're not too weak. Oh, right, pyrovision. So does she heat it up? Not as scary as it sounds. Natural hot springs, high temperatures that not everyone can withstand. Be funny if they have three star characters who are just basic NPC models with visions like her. Few travelers gotten scalded by the water. An unwritten rule need to adapt to lower temperature artificial springs first. Have to be so strict, formidable adventurers know they can handle it. Famous last words, not to be underestimated, never be too careful, environment's unstable because of the ley lines. This about to attack? Hmm, I wonder. Sounds dangerous, not all that formidable, careful is good. Yeah, looks as a risk taking on my watch, take them to the artificial spring first. Ooh, lightning in the distance. Hi, hi, Susurio. More like it. Don't try and think funny. Head into the artificial spring. Don't see you there. Bring free meals in my place are done. Mm. Well, I've even been feeling. Much better. Energy to keep an eye on all your passes. Oh, very tattooed, too. Over there, how many times have I told you they're roughhousing? You're the hot springs. Who is she talking to? Just those kids. You? The weird light is back. Ron, I'm not. Stir, talking to. It's basically a lifeguard then, or. A lot of energy. Old friends, you're really close. Regin in our trunk, everyone knows her. He's resisting her. 
This candle gave her meaning. For inherited an ancient name, one of the most renowned wars, famous for all the hot springs, threw parties there. And anyone who came there as hot spring bodies. Senyute. Wiliwo, Kayuani, and Bichamai, and Mwabuika. Wiliwo was the funny cryo boss fight. Crying mini boss for Kachina. Go to your taking vengeance, hot springs, too. During battle, impaled in the admin by an abyssal mob. Ooh. She saved her life, made it clear she could never bathe again. Huh. So power exists in her body, immersing in it would accelerate corrosion. The illness. No way to cure it, her. So many scars, so seriously injured. No one will never talk about the injury. Tasks over years to dig up artificial springs, more people can experience natural wonders that she can't enjoy them herself. Spectre for that. Presume we bought the end. We'll help her out, maybe? Do the artificial springs, get some before it's gonna be in some real hot water. Ha uh -huh. Okay. Head for the artificial ones. They're over there, and. Antalaha was a net. Buy anything? Not yet. Probably just fishing rods, I would assume. The old trailer you had. Milani fishing. Amina, great idea, I like it. Yeah, idea, dame. Kikueru, she would agree. Get moving. Sharkbone guitar. How to wear this slipped in once? Morrow cow. Oh, well, there's names. Seems like a cheerful day. What's the case? Hello, Soja. Seems like you're having fun. You're back. Who are these two? Famous individuals. Traveler Pramon, important guests, take the, the natural ones. Attack Goddess had to come here first. Coincidence, just talking about her. Tia's illness taking a turn for the better. How can you tell? Been busy with the pilgrimage, no, she's been busy with hot springs all along. In the cave to the north of the settlement. Go there all before they become abandoned for some reason. Ever come to Kate, the hot water before, visiting every night? Obvious what that means. Maybe she's actually fought monsters. Renovate the abandoned spring water back. Huge surprise party. It's a great idea too, so... Looks like some secret is going to come up there. Is a chair up there? Or what is that? Think of pulling this off without me. I'm busy right now though. Can find it once we're down to hot springs. Take your time. Focus on our guests for now. Special spring is pretty new. Experience is just as good as the natural. Turn them. Hope you enjoy. Ten then on sin. Natural ones. You too. Focus on a taste of surprise. Don't forget your patrol duties. A biscuit attack at any moment. You need to stay vigilant. Aren't you saying, Andre? Don't worry. Keep an eye out. You can count on us. See the abandoned spring. Off then? Okay. Hmm. So if I went up there. That's the question. Find another cure. And I'd have fun. Goodbye. We're in swimmer to the changing room. That's. We're just gonna get sent straight there. Change into the outfit. Which is over that way. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Okay. But I think actually going to the abandoned one real quick could be interesting. It's up over there. Should be on the other side of Oh. Other side of the cave we were able to get into partially before. I just want to see you then. Is this the right one? I think it's the right one. I would hope. Okay. So a key should be somewhere around here, maybe. Maybe. Well, it shows some promise. Try this out. Come on. Dig. And that was interesting. Maybe it's up on the other side. Maybe. Hello there. Put the Koreo. Emily and keep burning. And no key there. Keep the burning going in order to damage pretty well. Thanks. Thank you. 
And the clone's good, and what are we gonna get? Just a couple of wooden whistles. Okay. There should be one more around this general area. Frogs in there. Oh, probably up top. Those are two keys. There's one right there. To open the gate. That. Oh, wait, what? Is this a. Oh, a local legend. Okay. I think, yeah. This is. Gonna get another blue. Ring? Or. Not? Yeah. Okay, and just a chest from that. And we have to light these all up to oh, a shadows like blades deepening. A local legend moment! Oh goodness. Ooh, okay. Thank you. I wonder what team I'm going to want to use here though. Too much try fighting this guy first. Milani actually could work quite well. Maybe. Nahida and Milani. Uh, though to be frank, I should probably just try the standard new VIA team first. This is good sustain and actual shield, so. Nice that, that was marked on the map, but you can only hope for so much. That challenge over here was completely unmarked too. But that local legend is just in here, and that's the first not one local legend I've actually encountered. Oh, I've got multiple achievements. I wonder if I could refight. Hit Balashko. Yeah, so they've got some replay slash refight value. That's fun. That'll add up nicely. Thanks. And two, three, four, five, and dodge. Do Ooh, I did not expect it to hit by that. Okay, cool. And dodge that and uh, Maybe not such a good idea. And, ooh, one heck of an attack there. Dodge it pretty big. And that did not hit me correctly. Okay. Ah, interesting. Just like that, maybe. And where are you? Luckily, we can keep some of these out of the way, I suppose. But, uh. Oh, alright. Plan attack with careful observation. Which. Dodge it. Oh, this one, this one. Yeah. Presumably. And that's all. There we go. Nice. Got that working. Make sure not to fall for any of the fake clones. Good stuff. And not nice. Take that down. Thank you. And good stock. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, big res. That's not good. Thank you. I oh, please. Come on. And two. Oh, well, of course. That's a shame. So, just like that, and. Where are you then? Uh, thanks. And like that, and. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And. Oh, goodness. Can I. Let me make sure we don't. Which one? Which one? Oh, well, I. Dang it, dang it, stupid, stupid. Yeah. Fell for the wrong one. And, well, it kind of works. Well, let's go for one. Fight. Okay, these guys are legitimately ridiculous. They are a hut above to a ridiculous degree. Four, five, six, seven, eight. It's gotta be a weather there. Stuff is active at the moment or not. And it's where are you? Thanks, boom. Oh. And well, that did it, Balashko. That is a lot of... A lot of materials. Okay. 24. Interesting. It's in Duelist. Which... I have to be crazy to beat those all. 
No targets beside the original body while Balashka was using Shadow Void tactics. Well, kind of messed one that, kind of messed that one up. We we're close. Okay. So that was all we would get from clearing out those hot springs. Then it was interesting though, especially just the fact that. Local Legends had a little puzzle that worked mostly just to get access to them. I have to ruin that fight. Said it. I don't dislike that. Okay. So. Back change into the Milani outfit, and. Quite frankly, there aren't a lot of good spots, sir. Uh, Teleport here then. Hmm. Keep on moving. So we got a couple of trash artifacts. And. Oh, well, to be fair, the best way to get there would probably be using more surfing. To an extent. And we want to find your obsidian totem. Hello there. And just like that. Cool. Location unlocked. Visit the totem pole to learn more. Karamuru. Found my reputation with the people that springs. Countless tourists before finally coming to your attention, and level one is needed. Oh, we got a good amount of. Oh, because it's Toyok Springs exclusively. Ooh, lightning. Tracer no tracing. Then, secret no finding, but. Interestingly enough, it doesn't seem as if... Or maybe... Main Archon Quest might be for Flower and Feather. But it's individually more for each. So in the chamber, total attain, not one. Outcrop search. Oh, tribes with max reputation reach. Because it's different. Speaker's chamber, anything in the middle, or... Special recipe gift and special furnishing gift. Oh, interesting. So... Some new wings of soaring flame. Now on card back. Pyro treasure compass, paraculous resonance stone. It's the most we can get to this patch cycle. Borderline billet trove. Blazing flint or a very special item. Hmm. Gold harbors, fire your pulse thrumming. Hold high against the starry sky, the gentle gleam that illuminates the night. Presumably these would be Shibalanke slash Pyro Traveler. Constellation mats. Finally, a usable Pyro Traveler. Supply notice and bounties. Hello, Karamuro. Morning, what is it? Morning. My reputation, thank you so much for your help. Lock this now. This is place, Obsidian Totem Pole, connected to the wild here. Sacred Relic, details escape me. You've never been good at history. Anything more you'd like to know? Person on the night shift. Help us a little, turn pull, do you dirty. Hmm. Good day. Well, can't shout for too long. Not an introvert working out as they are. Getting caught slugging up to a ballad for me. Shift to your help and do that while being here. Let's see who comes at night. Goodbye after I get off of work tonight. Pretty much about that guard duty stuff then. Said I. I think I'll wait until I beat the first Archon Quest then. Do you want to see. Oh, and Kahuna! Spit on the nose, which is night shifts of that kid. Turn and pull, other tribes, wines is us, people of strings, commit permissions, pull grant, correspond recompense, also my thanks on behalf. Karma during the day shift, can't let them get off scot free. Get swap back, wouldn't change much, day shift or the night, one important spot, so we've got to watch it. So give them back over the head, I'm the responsible one though. Okay. Alright, personal business, don't mind me. Reputation, friend, come to help. Among other things, I can't do reputation for other regions now. It's locked off because we've completed them all. Said I can complete that one world quest easily and get where I need to start leveling the reputation, but I'll wait for a bit. So. Changing room is over there, but right, we should actually switch to Milani. Yep. 
Right over here then. Thank you. Okay. Home of the hot springs. Change the outfit. Wait, wait what does it fit surprisingly well? Phew. Uh, yep, and we got new outfit basically. Slightly different outfit for Milani too. Oh, Paimon! Paimon too, cute. Ponytail. They think warmth relaxes every muscle in your body. Your heart and your body. So nice, steam is warm too. First time I came here, no calming effect whatsoever. Put a wall of energy, my little boy ran off to the high temp pools. Actually, pretty funny. Looking back on it, Fran did for me all over. Head slowly poke out from under the water. Do you to remember? Whole OG will tell me all about it. Natural born swimmer. Myself had to dive underwater for first time when swimming. Feel free to go for a swim right here if you need a rescuing. Here goes nothing. Atemi. Oh ho. Ateo-san came to check on us. Bring some of the Saurian crackers. This is so cute. Yeah, new outfit. Body Wilson, milk and snacks, just a year from here. Temperature artificial springs isn't too high. Source crackers, grain fruit trips, grain chips. Thank you, arigata na. Milk. These are grain. Can make them myself. I cook. There are a few young people know how to appreciate hot springs. Watch them carefully. Temperature not only determines types of snacks you should choose. Also, the amount of time you should spend in the water. Bay, this attempt to remind. So, we are in the pool is incredibly disruptive and impolite. So you should not learn from Bolani. Hmm. Yeah. Looks like you're able to adapt a problem, able to switch to the natural ones. I got going, drink your milk, looking at you. Supporting the water when you were little. Happen again, if I'm here to catch you or not. Didn't think you were about to do something like that. Oh, she's got these funny ponytails, too. It's got the crown, of course. Think I can get away with it. Milk is easy to spot me pouring clear water, not my best work. Drink the milk, enjoy things. Dizzy if I stand here too long, you are right. Oh, there's a bit of stuff, you'll find too. Should have thought of the The natural is, by the way, after we leave you on your own for a little while this afternoon, fix up the abandoned spring. Don't trust their aesthetic tanks, soon as what will become the bites find we have been unattended. I'm going to have a couple shops worth a visit while two. While they're not on the way. Wait? Today has been nice to us, so we'll repay the favor. Snacks, sauce about hot springs, want to do our part too. So to help each other out, feel bad otherwise. Then more the merrier. Then the arigato. And going or not is the best hot spring gathering no one's ever seen. Sako no unsen party. Yosh. Isa shupats. Okay. Marukal and the others. Over in. Over there. Hmm. Is that? Oh no, it's this cavern. And I'm stupid. Found the local legend at least. Yeah, because this is just right over there. I may be stupid. Okay. Hmm. Brother gets too. Kyakusama. Kind of like customers, similar word. Here to help. Important guests can't put you to work. Want to do a part? Nothing else to do at the moment. Alright, stop trying to outplot each other. The sooner we get the party started, so we get to enjoy the real party. Where to start? Water out and block pretty bad. Need to dig under it. Hmm. Box in the corner, throw it out as well. The moldy is all get out. Someone's who out, get some cloth, wooden decorations, and snacks. For 20 or 30 people, for purchase, for purchase prices. Except the first offer, haggle. I better haggle, let him go. Not better, wouldn't know what to buy. Handle things here, do we do with the shopping? Cute. So I'm a soft guy. Shop's over at it, meet back here later. Okay. Market Street, buy the necessary goods. To digging, let's go. So that's actually... Not all that far, but still... Right, and oh, we can use that too. 
over to the uh, shops. This is where they sell fishing rods. Fishing spears, too, it seems. Harpoons. Hanjo shitteru? Yewa thoth. It's not like the name they have in Japanese. Back from the pilgrimage. It's right to make the cut. It'll be a competition everyone got to win. Where will be today? On the list, size of what orders you can see. Expect a discount. Large order. All for a party. Keep it between us. Hot spring for a tail. Go on the weekend. Great news. How about this? Decoration of the house. 20% off cloth and wood. Huh. Sweeten the deal, pot was sitting there still off for the pilgrimage. Get rid of it, it's gonna go moldy. Alright, such a hat, give me a moment while I'll pack it all up for you. Hmm. It's amazing. On a day's work, two stones for sale. And what about that? Won't come cheap. I'll put a haggle and pack them separately, also decorations. Kachina's gemstone has come across some map buy for her, a gift when she comes back. Victoria's from Battle, one of them, sure she'll like it. Eat everything, just double check, make sure nothing's missing. Quite of juice. Since Kachina related to her, just on the house, at all houses in that. Some years ago, this attacked her trap and to save my brother's life. The rest ran in return, don't forget what she did for my family that day. Send my regards and have fun. Can be a party to remember, thanks a lot. Shopping done, head back. It's quick enough. Oh, is it tele it's teleporting us. Fair. Back has everything, and it seems cleaned up. Cleaned up nice, water unlocked. Hope so, all the coin out debris from the bottom of the spring. Guys, you get everything. Tons of stuff set down near the cave entrance. Up your sleeves, let's get back to work. So you two take a break and head over from here, mind lending me a hand. Say the word, have a help. Brains are way over. Something on the wall, sex and traits over there. What are we gonna draw? Take it. Basically, not. Oh, a little guitar like, loot like. Gotta be something. Wine instruments. The Ipu Hua. Or. Wait. Ipu Hula Gord. A gourd Ipuhua, any string instruments? Or. Oh, well, ukulele, but. Mm, not bad. No idea, you're such a great designer. Usually the one in charge of family store, family store, renovation or organization. Group effort, didn't expect to take quite the slime. Great to invite that to over. We're gonna work, patrols are going to the abyss. Taya volunteered on watch tonight. Have to wait until tomorrow. Get a good thing. Move exhaustion by soaking. Gonna love it. Call it a day and retire to the inn. Okay. So, return to the inn to rest and. They're not over there right now. It's actually much closer to the teleport point. Hmm. Let's go over here. And get that back. Good old Night Soul transmission. Let's, yep, get on. Move around, switch, and there we are. Bulletin board. Golden Dust, Red Retro, and the People of the Springs. Guess what, Dark Cuisine? Ea Kako. Welcome to bring on green cook. Chef go out to prayer. Every ingredient cooking with passion. No extra charges. Water in guest rooms. Provide tents for camping. Falling asleep to laughing the waves. That's instead of dawn on the sea. Surprise, lucky candies, golden dust. Pomakai. Golden grain fruit, kernel candies, the dishes. Lucky candy, 50% off. Water sports products, a leisurely puffer. The Springs Regional Qualifiers, Inferno Stomach Supremo. Competition haven't changed, most specified discs from his prizes. Race a collective party, 80 servings of hot spring o'clock. For the competition, including champion, race appetites, becoming greatest wars, and winter challengers, is the crown of the current contest. Restaurant has been a bit short-handed, hunting other hosts or hostess, and special clients, passion, and sunny disposition. 
We have a bit of medicine to our spine. Food doesn't agree with him. Get upset stomachs. Need to take care of them. Instead, we have a message goes straight to Kupo Nui. And for appointments, doors are always open. His hostess enjoy cold drinks too. Our singer is Tirda, pouring far for the clan. Sky's intensity, red velvet. New album bubbles. Search a quick quaddle rec Oh, it's a music records. It's experience stay here at the People of Springs. Rarely seen themes and styles. Unique voice. Declared composition. Innovative instruments. Auditory feats for ears. It's a recommendation. Fresh iced milk. Iced mint burst. Iced green fruit meat soup. Only iced drinks. But warmer. Hot milk. Hot mint person. Hot green fruit meat soup. It's supposed to be hot in the first place. Recommendations. Okay, so it's now it's repeating. Okay. We saw that. Inside the inn, then. Turn to the inn to rest. Here we are. Sit. Go to get the next sleep. See you tomorrow. What the ass touch now? Sugi. Exhausted all over the place today, didn't we? We'll rest over the party, so head inside. Gonna dream of something frightening, maybe. Maybe. Or not. Mmm. So we're watching their flight to arms. They're going to arms. Why now? All the noise. Wake up. Oh, so. This will break up. Oh, uh oh. All these monsters come from. Okay, Rift Towns. Are the most pure of this land as we've seen. Draw them back as we speak. Take you somewhere safe. No, we gotta fight him. To hit I can't hold him back much longer. Be right there. Come to and fight. Lightning can set it better myself. We're here to help. Basically, we say we just kill them. Trial Moani with good stuff and no boss, whatever. Come on, come on, and. And bite! Good damage, and bite again! Unless we miss. Bite, and he's contaminated by the abyss. Oh, are the abyss. Abyss of Dragon. Stay off. And how much damage are you going to take given that they are a couple of swords? Bite. Fuck off. Bite. And continue. And oh, it's from water. That's a nice little point for sure. Bite. And bite. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Help the others. This inclusion has died. So a Yungasaur. Cool abyssal filter on them. Lots of fights like this too. Stop and two bite. Oh goodness. Bite. Yep, no res. It's much better. And come on. Bite. Oh you know, let's get off and just use. The shot and hit. Talk to Milani. Okay. Anything more or? Put out most of the monsters over here. Thanks for your help. Taking me ages on my own. So for one more. Well, she basically did it by herself. You know where the creatures are coming from. How many have better handled the situation? Presumably it's that this time they failed to win. So the trial, Milani, because this is. Special story mode. So let's actually see. I can talk to anyone in here. Hmm. And it does not seem as if much going on other than just go to Amina, which makes sense, but still. There and where's it gonna cut off? Okay, around there. Like that. Well, keep moving on water. Thank you. And jump. Jump. Continue our surfing. Okay. Yunkasaur warriors. Interesting. It's not expecting the canopy stuff. Oh, so a special message. Dangerous situation. Go back and help out. Right. Okay, cool. There we are. So Amin is here. Door resurrection activated. We have to use... Obsidian Pillar to enter the Night Kingdom, maybe? Amina? You three, thanks for helping clear all those monsters. 
Prepare for an attack and have enough people to prevent them from breaking through our defenses and their casualties so far, though. They come from this side. East side could avoid the position Abyssal Pylon. Nine power to take it down. And what is that? Kiyomonte. Gate created by the Abyss allows monsters from the Night Kingdom to enter the physical world. Night Kingdom is basically some kind of para abyss, maybe? We end up the attack, destroy the pilot as soon as possible, and no swords of monsters will exhaust our defenses. The most concerned about numbers suggest there might have been multiple pilots in the area searching them as we speak. So I'll have one of the east, can I come and help again? Sure. Let's do this. And just sit back and do nothing. People of Spring said my thanks, counting on you. Go, no time to lose, take care. Sasuke Go? It's from the Abyssal Pilot in Manua. Can't talk to him right now, though. Have the people counting on you. We should go in then. Ninon Career. Okay, so she's just moving over that way. So in the east, in that general direction. Can we interact with the wild right now? We cannot. So it seems a little sealed off, but there have been a number of special modes, basically. It's interesting. Well, Night Soul Transmission. That'll help. And... I'm surfing up. The power one is... Over there. Oh, interesting looking thing. Oh, and it looks like one of the rings from... I feel like Swords is stuffed. Sends upon the world, this one rejection of all that is. Targets protected by void bearers can't be damaged while offended by it. Only by attacking with the elemental attacks, a certain number of towns can't be destroyed. Additionally, Night Soul aligned elemental attacks seem to be able to destroy void bearers with greater ease. Okay. So, can't take any damage right now. Completely immune. Not completely immune, but definitely can't kill them yet. Okay. And I did not mean to do that. Okay. And. Attack and. Okay. One, two. Hit and. Oh, goodness. Oh, come on. I break this thing down and. Hit. Hit and. Oh, that did not hit the right one at all. Well, it. Put that down for sure and. Maybe we just keep on biting. Honestly. Night's old bites. It's not so bites with application. Let's see that working. Oh, and is, is that. Now we can destroy the stupid thing. I hope. I, again, did not mean to do that. Thanks. And. Hit. And that just blew it up? Okay. Fair enough. Should do it right. In Bayonetta. Didn't see any more monsters, so it looks like we're in the clear. Can't stop in a lot. Hard on your try. That wing shape. Say a word to me, represent gateways. Makes things hard sometimes, how our ancestors have always lived. This isn't your difficult for lives, or finding back is the only option. Head back, what are you looking at? Something over there. Oh, headed for the hot spring, or... So many. Going from that direction. Looks kind of familiar, abandoned spring. Gotta go protect it. Don't have any reinforcements over there, I'll just move. I wonder why they're going there, decreasing in number. Keep it up. Well, we guess we're doing pretty well. So, let's go over. There ends. Another pod or what? Okay. Come on, then. And. Bye. Thank you. And. Bot again. Keep on hitting. And. Uh, interesting. Decent application for that. And that again. Fight again, yeah. And oh come on, you. I uh, again did not mean to do that. Annoying. Time where it qualifies is honestly too high. And here we are. Thank you for the help. Because it's interesting to see if stronger versions are also being allies. And is that a tail over there? <coughs> Oh, her illness is pouring back. Is she gonna die? Uh oh. What are you doing here? Where's the pylon? What do you think? Thing is long gone. Oh, so she destroyed it. 
Cost for life, not my best work. Check if all the important stuff is still here. Time for now, one looks bad, perhaps crowding her body. Right here, hey, hello, anyone there? Not even knowing it was a party for her, she was trying to defend it. Go on, told the second pawn was over here. Her care of it injured, so get a doctor. Alright, stop fussing. Think I know my own limits. My thing is, destroy anything. The last friend of the night, how much work you put into it. Meant to be a surprise. For her, she knows. Hmm. Bass on, couldn't tell you were avoiding me on purpose. Now, why don't you stop by and say hello? Because you're obviously writing something. I got bought snacks. Times out of 20, she was based on the temperature of the water. The doctor's almost here, gonna get all better. You'll we'll be able to make whatever you want, have to hold on. Injured by the abyss before, why the corrosion so fast this time? Make until health relapse, something I can do. Purification. Exactly! Just like in Mondstadt. Mental energy wing and body repel each other. Oh my goodness, I didn't even realize that that was White Realm lore in 1.0. Abyss and White Realm stuff. Crystals have been purified. When? English brought into tears. She dropped a crystal, purify it. So, is this gonna work back then? So, are we going to purify, purify the abyss at the end of this quest line? What do you mean? Oh? Gonna bring up a graphic or. Siphoning the abyss? Purification, abyssal power being cleansed away. Hmm. Is this sort of a. Power to reconcile the world, basically? Or how can that be? Dude, that was even possible. And she cured or just alive now? The abyss is gone. Get that? You all right? Or a spiritual magical illness? Her father power didn't injure you. I'm fine. Sure, of course. See. All good. Look at that. Thank goodness. Look at that. Sure, I'll have to dance just now. Yeah, yes, there. It's over to surround you and Atea. They were over and over welcoming a triumphant hero. Yes. Head back, get some rest, meet here tomorrow. Recovery and our tribe over the abyss. Show how grateful we are for their aid. Case remember, dismiss. Alright. Bit of a surprise, honestly. Any secret powers? Not Pyro yet. And through, thank you. Just forgot he had that ability back in Monset from the Bones Tears. I'm thinking he's bothering you. Oh, but in theory, maybe in Chengyu, the fact we were able to cleanse the abyss. Well, before that was also the adaptable power in Fujin, which is presumably a celestial envoy too, so that's more imaginary versus quantum. Did more spell the mood earlier, purifying the abyssal power within Atea, sense something. It means that the power existed within her body for years, corroding from the inside. Sense the power already deeply ingrained. Fragile as a dried leaf in the wind. So it exists within her body, hot water, sorry, the corrosion. The illness has taken a turn for the better. Or, couldn't come into contact before, every night. Oh, going there because she was based on the edge and didn't care about living or dying. She was going to hot springs for recovering. Decisive turn for the worse. Shouldn't tell her. Some other time, but keep her eyes open. Head back for now. That's so lingering. Return to the end of rest. Time for the party. Huh. Take part and it sent us back there. At least I didn't have to go back myself. And. Yep, yeah, let's go up here. And will this not quite work? And. Should be a decent way to get this done. Jump, and. Thank you. Cool. Lacking any. For guessing is a little annoying at the moment. Oh well. And here we are. Wonder if and when Atea is gonna kick it, frankly. Sucks. And got a real guitar. 
And now that she's hanging out with the other kids, we're going to ask her about what's going on. Snacks on her case, temperature too high. And the above, and this obsidian crystal, interesting, sense it, didn't you? Yeah. We're going to keep it a secret for a few more days, and more ruined celebrations all, because I was no use. My kid, who me? Nani? Come, let's go for a walk. Don't let something happen. Talk about her death, or maybe a bit sore draw. Some air too noisy in here. Oh, right back, extra sex. And a box of pimping for punishing. All fresh this morning. Sounds great. Hmm. Okay, focusing over there. That's the stay a bit, but. Oh well. Oh, so tall. It's just a rambunctious kid causing trouble all around the hot springs. Best by in the blink of an eye. Her parents. We had business seriously. Acting strange. Might be the last time. Something happened, both of you seem off today. Should explain. So this new hot springs, so I was getting better. Power didn't go face it by myself because I was reckless. I'm just to wait for reinforcements. Sacrifice, because there was no point. Body isn't going to last much for longer. Stay mm. in the cave, because that enjoy the celebration just a few days shy of the end. Just try to enjoy them as long as I have webs. Provision, though. Murani? Better not happen again, whether I'm here to catch you or not. Back in the spring, had a bad feeling you didn't want it to be true. I want to believe you were actually recovering. When there's sudden recovery death, but you aren't all that different, both of them celebrating. You should never been resurrected, but I understand death my old pals by now. Reunited with an old friend. Passing down a name, or... Tay a candlekeeper, maybe? Regret? This man can no longer take the front lines. Special donation slow deeper in a crisis. Tay got injury. Why don't we have a white girl that regret? Not only because I've had the strength to fight the abyss, even though I am my life, see you in action. Now there, we always don't need to worry about our trauma or the future. We pass it and bring this all together. When I was never injured, old age would still take me one day. Didn't want to need to do. Future is in your hands now. Remember why for death all is with you. Tomoniiru. Rusan, giving this a lot of thought. Thank you for telling me all this. Alani jump scare. Katayo. Zenyakube. With all my power. Tribe nation will up to the example you set for me. And you've got the chance to be the Archon, give this to her for me. Yes, pendant or hmm. Tells me to carry it in my whole life. Strange to say, it's still alive. Just think of it as a relic I'm leaving for her. Not the good fortune now. Even after it became too sick to fight, never took it off. Kind of a conch shell type thing. Embodies fond memories and strength of will. Know what I'm trying to say? Might be an ancient name type thing. So she gets it, all I wanted to say, head back to the party. Spend all the time I have left being sad. Hmm. Alright then. The tower up there. Should definitely try to climb it with Katrina, I'd say. Here we go. Don't hurry up, won't be any snacks left. What I said about bathing on a full stomach, listen to me. That's get cramps. Every time, festive goodbye, time to go. She says goodbye with a smile. That's the end, which is a group. It's Moani on the shoulder lightly. Life is a journey, which is no turning back, so forge ahead and don't hold back. Hmm. Oh, that's the end of that quest. Okay. And now we've unlocked blessings of Tona Swain, Power Sigils, Tablet of Tona, Sacred Flames Protection, and Blessings. Huh. Decision, wait until two days later, a Taya's Talisman. As I wonder what the hot springs were never to dry, nor friends to sing goodbye. The slime was no longer plagued by darkness, and her children could relish the joys within their reach, free from both care and worry. Nothing like that could really exist, so knowing it could would be enough. Even if I didn't live to see it. We will weaken my hot spring body and the god I trust and follow. The flames bind us close, even death cannot part us. 
Not on is with you and no one fights alone. Huh. Two things later. Collect a few of those and get some artifact juices. Triple Chronicles, Blackstone under a white stone. Huh. Mysterious Island. But the other ones. I have to wait for some of them. Tablet of Tona. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Okay. Check that out. Keita. That forge. Focus engraving. Do you feel the study kids these days? It's about. Potions made of the Tablet of Tona. Simply like. Sheen our tribes at the six um, sacred flame, presumably in the middle. The wick is ring. The flame every native not let close connections with others in the tribe, sort of the Archon. Protection is desire, prayer before the tablet. So here we can get weapon blueprints. Our home, salutary furnace, super fly, miss the beat again. By weapons, thing. Diagram and oh, it needs gills. Earth Shaker needs. Oh, Ember Core Flowers. Core Flowers. Spinel Fruit. That. A total of 20 of those. Lots of grain fruit, lots of mushrooms. Decent amount of cockawattle. Earth Shaker needs a couple of these. Forging Method. Self Defense, that's crap. It up a bit more. I can get a bit higher too. Okay. Let's see. Okay. That's good. Sit back a little instead of going all the way forward, but we've got a good amount of condensed crystals. Elena's surface, but also not on it seems. Record flower. Hmm. So I'll look for it. Honestly, a bit annoying to find. So over here, we can check this out then, I suppose. Our sigils, adventures in Nalan, Tablet of Tona, Tablet of Pox. Each level obtain valuable rewards. 30 per. Huh. Tones Flame. Oh, a Claymore Sword Villain. Okay. Number of blue fates. Mm -mm. 300 wood, well, 600 would take it to 20, and I presume that's where the limit is right now. To see. Signs of the canopy quests. Check that out real quick. So, in the meantime, I guess I could do that one quest line so I could always unlock People of the Springs of Bounties. It's an idea. Oh, some up here. Down to oh, the funny pillar. Hello, and Player Yunkasaur. Aqua. Reputation from Hootslan. Previous act. Reputation. Quest. Heroes Right. Kenicha's Deal. It's their number of quests. Night. What is the night? Night for Trouble. Watchapec Mountain, Supply Notice, and leaves up to four, yeah. <laughs> How best to go in without going over then? <laughs> Let's finish the quest. Okay. Right over here, we can that engraving, iridescent inscription. Up there. We'll make another island show up, I believe. Hi, hi. Investigate, gone again. Roar. Jotstone tablet, those that receive the flame complete the trial and head to the floating item. Floating island, island. And that trial. Oh, there. And this rock. Here, this should be the last mechanism. One's no different from the others. Sure, you haven't fallen for some kind of trick, Roar. It's not just suffering ancient scrolls, but common some confidence and certain degree of confidence in my abilities. And shrinking by the second help, 
Sure, this isn't the last mechanism. Remember, why wait larger and more complete? Floating islands. And what, irrespective of the great problems you show, no, I understand them as you speak in full sentences. Treasure is real, elixir exists, and we know once you've given it a try. Roar. It's not working this time, working the next, not here somewhere else in the game. There, that happens sooner or later. Welcome back. Beat the first Archon quest out of the two of this patch, so... You have to wait a couple of in-game days to start the next one, so... I'm doing a world quest so I can unlock reputation. How are you? There's no bounds, motivate yourself to keep trying, miracle in and of itself. Take it as a compliment, roar. Decide to, come on, forget to activate the mechanism. Well, got an okay amount. We gotta complete this trial. Oh, spear away stuff. So presumably we need to hop on Milani. Turn to that ball, try and tell us to fall by riding the spear away. Final trial, go, go, go. And that looks for the cure all injuries. Well, let's be the final trial. This is just basic open world RPG type stuff. And how are we supposed to grab that net and just collect all the orbs? Spearways up here, jump on top of that, yep, we switch. Oh, we're just going all around the islands while following that, and we'll just collect the orbs. Did a sort of open world encounter with a similar obstacle course to this a bit early and got the highest ranking. It's a lot of fun, and that would just. Knock us off at the end, jumping around like this is actually pretty fun. Roar. So you can use these abilities by either indwelling the corresponding elemental dragon, which you can find around, or just using character, which it's more fun if to use the character you have, that just so you can see them, instead of just turning into a dragon. Well, it depends on how you much you like dragons, I guess. I do like dragons, but I picked up Milani. I may as well use Milani. Sends us up, so we'll reposition in midair to get all the orbs, and that should be everything. This is where we were before. Was he considered the Sage of Sacred Flame? Well, it wasn't that spirit way there from the start. Switching back and forth. Very Sonic Grind relevant. And this, very Sonic. And get that. Just make sure we get all of them. It ends over there. To on the grind rail. On this island. Okay, there's a chest over there and inscription gone again, that's odd. Touch the inscriptions. Oh, I could have maybe hopped off some kind of mechanism. So have to go back to that floating island or not the side. I did not mean to hit that one. Very cool view of a whole accessible area of not one right now though. Yeah, in-game days. Not real-world days. Or are wrong hidden ahead. The center sanctum whole new floating island in the middle. I was not deceive you, center of the upper sanctum. It's appeared. Don't worry. The whole point of the inscriptions from before was to open the way to the island. To the center. And that. Complete the trial of the upper sanctum, make the floating islands reveal themselves. I was responding on the Sun Sports Jura, and that was the one that I just beat Act 1. What's interesting is that the Archon Quests themselves don't have reputation rewards right now. They usually do, but I guess they don't have a try for them to count for at the moment. Fair enough. And here we are. We're over to the stone tablet in the middle. Is there a teleport point around here? Point of pure desolation. That's kind of sad sounding. It's the same thing, really. If you die in the game, you die in real life, right? Upper Sanctum, realm of purity that was hidden away, entrance seal in midair. Once upon a time, an all merciful sage its secret arts to great disciples in this place, yet in the end, for reasons unknown, it was concealed. Huh. And those are some sort of enemy. And as far as I can tell, I don't see any... Teleport points around here. Never died once in a video game. Even Minecraft? That actually... If so, that's rather impressive, actually. It... Does that speak to exceptional skill or exceptional... Cowardice? Or both? No. Prudence it Oh. Oh. 
<clears throat> Guards, rip off this guy's nutsack and feed it to the strange creature that lives in the woods. Okay. Look around, but yet in the middle, and presumably we'll run into some avatars of lava. I would think. Maybe. Glad you enjoyed it. Because we're right over the Satcher of the Seven, but... Does not mean all that much. There's a chest down there, a chest up here, another one by that inscription. No space left in the inventory, which means we feed more to Sethos. Definitely gotta do some strong boxes or artifact juicing soon. This guy's so weak. Just makes me sad. A lot of Electro characters function best when they can basically work as on-fielders for a very strong Electro off-fielder official. But Sethos isn't even all that good at that. Or at the very least, they're far better options. It's because he's a 4-star as opposed to 5-stars. It's sad. There are a number of good 4-stars, especially good accessible 4-stars. But... Most of them were from the very start of the game, and basically were good by accident. And they've never made any that are as ridiculous since. Some that are pretty good, especially ones that work well with Dendro. But to be fair, that also includes Fischl. Some a little ends. I think those avatars of lava will wake up and try to fight us. In the center of the upper sanctum, I was wondering why it looked so different from what I saw in the pictures. In response, after all, I wouldn't be in charge of looking after all those ancient ruined scrolls if I wasn't. Apart from that even larger rock in the middle, nothing else here. Giant rock itself would be the same as a legendary gift. Roar. That's a little dragon who we met when we first came to Nalan. I named after named him after a dragon from Elden Ring. Generally stumped, all the scrolls I've seen here was past the trial, which is place and sense the spirit of the Sage of Stolen Flame. Unless it's just Fulgus itself. Which is place about passing the trial, supposed to feel as if you're being called somehow. No idea what that means in practice. Probably shouldn't be able to work that out once I got here that I could. Looks like that was wishful thinking. Stretch out your hand, shows of dragons presumably reached out to me. Follow trail this led up the temple within you and the fire within your heart. Then do you know what it means? Roar. Looking at me. Saw something, saw something, gracious me, one worthy gift to you after all, young lad. Didn't see anything either, a golden pattern. Roar, roar. Golden pattern. Saw the first time you met, Theodorix. Seeing things back there. Roar, roar. Telling Palmont, look up's no use, can't see it, seeing as you've said it's there. Sounds familiar, same person who wept that golden pattern before. Left it behind, it's the Sage of the Stolen Flame, who might be Shibolanke. A lore character in that one who may be playable eventually. In a save, previously being him in the sun of the Sage of the Stolen Flame, bright future ahead of you. Lies before you now, future is so radiant, showed great promise, wouldn't take a shot to you otherwise, have you figured out how to receive the gift? She's definitely gonna try to rob us, right? Just so have to reach out towards the giant stone tablet and. Oh. Cutscene. Maybe. A shot guarding the Avatar was summoned awakened. Final shot was indeed a battle after all. Roar. So these guys are ones who burn pretty well. He's burning to keep that going. And to be fair, we can deal actual decent damage to them first. And this is okay-ish. Um, uh, epic silly Milani moment, I guess. And another fight, hop off. Milani burst real quick. She does vaporize pretty well at times. At times. And the thing about these guys is that if you put down a lot of pyro on them, they'll just immediately explode and die. It's interesting, some of the other ones just have pyro always on them. They actually drop stuff. Quest enemies often don't drop anything. So we got lucky, I guess. Birds just appeared and came over here. And now it's going a little brighter. What a little bit risen somewhat springs now full of forgisting that orange tinge. Water below my knees is warm, warmth, warmth flowing through my limbs, a lovely sensation. Caesar's gift wasn't an elixir that can cure all injuries, but rather the hot spring here. Not exactly a surprise, given the people's springs aren't far off. Roar. Theodore's looking pretty cozy there. It's not just any old hot spring, little 40 Paimon. Here was been chosen bathes in the spring. We're into the power to wield the Gistin, but we already have that. Really, what will happen if Paimon types in? Good question. Think I know. That's a soaking wet Paimon that shows it. She might get these Gistin too, transform into a super awesome Pyro Paimon. Think not, haven't been chosen. Oops. 
You have the spots for maybe the final gift, claim your searching for an elixir and cure all injuries that each share us with share with us too. So many types of injury in the world. Possibly expect a single elixir to be able to heal them all, so what was her intention? Comes down to it, wisdom and solution all our worries, that's not tricky this time. When we make mistakes, we'll learn from them and we'll take one step closer to resolving our worries, isn't that a wonderful outcome too? Actually kinda of makes sense, injury is cured, or we're to use for Gistin. Even though I took it back in the hot spring field with it, we'd still be unable to use it in the past, so the ancient scrolls say. Perhaps people who had not already with Gistin only ever wanted to do so by passing the trial. Hasn't had any effect at all, because we did it for her. We from now on can't use Fogistin or Roar. You know, delayed responses can be quite hurtful at critical moments like this, and nearly everyone can use it, nearly is not all. He's very young, suffered a grave injury, in connection with the abyss so ab abyss opposed to Fogistin power. Pure elemental pyro power. Miracle I even survived, was in terrible health, told it I could jump great distances with an Atomosaur on my back. Fooling you, Atomosaurs would up make themselves light as a feather, so they don't wear a thing. Well, a thing. And the Atomosaurs are the animals, presumably. He will be to this injury, unable to use Phlegiston, no matter what I try, can't do it, wreck my brains, pour it over all kinds of different scrolls. Others view them virtually obsolete, well versed in analyzing Phlegiston engraving through patterns. A lot of effort into memorizing all the meanings, and owning a great memory while doing so, teaching the children which were not the basics about Phlegiston. Also an opportunity to observe how to discover the ability to use it, speaking of which, quite popular with the children. Everything there is to know about Phlegiston, more I understand, more in awe that I am. The more awe I feel, the more regret and frustration I feel for not being able to wield it myself. Good with kids. How nice. Well, thanks to you, able to make it through all those trials, understand that word skills from our ancestors' sacrifices must be made. A lot of people in Notlon have abyssal related injuries. And they call back to Mondstadt, where they also mention the opposition of elemental power to the abyss's power, which is because abyss is basically. Native to Tava, though presumably imaginary, Celestia's power would also be opposed to elements as well, maybe? Maybe. Don't have that kind of courage. Perhaps that's why I can't use Fogiston. Shiki Arar. Alright, came to terms with it a long time ago. If it doesn't work this time, always next time, find a way eventually. Thank you so much. Can't we heal her? How do you have the power to purify Abyss? For everything you've done for me, keep saying it. Find future ahead of your life. Not only are you amazingly talented, so kind as well. Like me, for whom everything seems to be set in place now, and I'm sure I'll have many more incredible adventures to look forward to. A little jealous, to be honest. I promise, wherever the road takes you, your travels will be smooth forever and always, and the same to you. Sure, you'll achieve your aspirations. No elixir can cure all injuries. Sure, you'll find an elixir can cure your injuries. Thank you. Last but not least, Theodorix. Words of general movement. Really in touch about what you've said, because you're someone that people can count on. It's for a little while longer, but relaxing after all, so here for a bit. Get back to pouring through ancient scrolls for a cure. Might be in for a school thing for running off from home, though. As you said, it's work hard to achieve my aspirations. That's the end of that world quest line. Not all treasure is silver and gold. And there are actually a few more spray fe feather gills here. Another iridescent inscription fragment. I wonder what we use. Them all four eventually failed to find the panacea. So that spoil that we wouldn't be able to find it. So, presumably these two are the other two tribes, the main world quest for this patch cycle. Hmm. Most of these can't even be done until... These two specifically cannot even be done this patch. Feather kill seed. Should be another, and we have a spirit way back, which might lead to that other chest we saw before. Great feature ahead of him, what's up? Tired enough for a soak in the hot spring. Haven't learned how to use Fugus yet. Back to no more killing as much as before. Seems like the healing I have here better than over at the People of the Springs. Still a long, long way from achieving my real goal, not having such a bad back thanks to the hot spring. That's for about, say, 10%. In essence, this actually had a healing effect, but there's only so much you can hope for here. So, Night Soul Transmission with a Milani. Heal Seed, and I think that is all that's right here. Seed of Life, Seeing Eye. Interesting. Poor retreat from within the body of a defeated avatar of lava emits a considerable heat. So that once, a, once such a coarse form left to itself, it will develop into a new avatar of lava. In life, it was once believed that all forms of life could be traced back to conflagration. I believe that's a reference to Heraclitus, who also talks about the idea of all the only constant is change, you can never step into the same river twice. And that I think Nala mentions that a few times too. Spark of burning matter, wait. 
In the spark of burning matter, we have the origins of the soul and such wisdom, very existence of avatars alive would bear out such a belief, or perhaps to the emergence of the sphere itself, that explains how they came to inhabit the land of not run, which sort of reverse causation then, maybe? But it... I want to see if anything here might replenish Forgissen. Say Forgissen Spring. This... Yeah, that is not replenished for guessing. So let's run the spear way back to somewhere. And is this a two-way spirit spring, or...? Seems like it might be. That's yeah, a two-way spirit spring. But there was another island over there that had a chest on it. I'm gonna go take a little look. This is... This is this two days later, even though some time now. Oh, now I think that's what unlocks that maybe? Hey, Not quite sure. Either way, let's take a look. This will lead me back there, but of course we've also got that updraft which we could also presumably use to reach that one island. Let's just see. This, yep. Is it taking me there or it's me down there? Also interesting. Duke is a little closer to death than I might like. So in that case, I guess I just have to climb up there, given that when that animal wind current was there, I could have used that to get onto that island, but I guess it's just glide and hope it works. Luckily, Kachina and her Night Soul transmission make this rather simple. Real fast climbing here. This is... Okay, just that. But there was also a... an inscription here before, but I saw it moving. Presumably to reveal that island. But... Found through the upper sanctum, we found a number of those... funny Milani grasses, so... That's good. In a couple versions, they should pad out a character who, at least in not one, can literally just fly, which is going to be interesting. One of the animal characters. That over there. Let me see. That island is... Wait. That one? Have I not been to that island yet? I can't even tell. That one might be new. Maybe. Not quite sure, but that... Let me see. Okay, so this is leading down there. So whatever's here. It looks like a Monitu. Which is basically not one. This version of the Seelies. Little fairies you can interact with who will then move towards and lead you to treasure. So this, this then, hello, one or two, maybe if we take these mushrooms, I wonder where they might be then. It's Forgiston, I think, and Night Soul, that wake them back up, no, it's just looking around, hello, this fire staff's fun. Look like moving hats, actually. It's pretty cute. Uh -huh. And yeah, that's a spot I couldn't get to exactly before. We get back to your spot and get back in. Turn it back into solid graffiti. Anything new from that? Do you want to try to collect those special rings to unlock a gateway eventually? This. Seems to be the end of that island, but actually, go over here. Maybe a bit more. Thank you. And that just leads that way, so. In that case. Guess we just jump onto here to ride this back up to the first island, maybe? Yeah, that just leads us back to the initial starting point island, which. We don't really have a reason to go to now. Not sure this one was initially there either. Given that a number of islands did appear when 
Yeah, I don't think this one was initially here. I think it was just this. I could go back and review old footage, not that it matters all that much. And another funny jump, and cool. Okay. So the only thing we really need from there otherwise is... Well, now we can actually level up our people at the Springs Reputation level 1, which means being able to actually do bounties for them. Which... Let's see how that goes. It's annoying that... Teleport is... No, no, we can teleport directly. Uh, that's really nice. Get that, and... We've taken that up a level. Okay. And that's just a couple kindling philosophies, but that's not even what Milani uses. It doesn't match. It's spring o'clock. Now we can do bounties. That's the quest from... The story quest for Milani and the tribe itself. Mm -hmm. Bounty, isn't that... How much? It doesn't say. Rewards, 143. This gives... We got a three. All cities, not one tribes. Are these all high level, or...? Hmm. I presume that this one is going to be the strongest because it's at the bottom, but it doesn't talk about the rewards yet. So that we source us waiting for me, I ended up duking it out. Battered and bruised. Didn't you study by a towering warrior? Knocked him out like a ragdoll. This got beaten up by the same guy who was it. Step nation, geo damage, new my characters and opponents, vulnerability to cryo, animal resistance decrease, but we can't make use of that in any meaningful way. Oh, but wait. Oh, that's right. I'm a complete idiot. Because I did... Oh, but actually... Can I do this? Supply notices, okay. So these are just requests, but they're down from here. But either way, there's our problem for the week. <laughs> I jumped the gun and did my bounties in Fontaine because... This patch changed it so you couldn't do bounties in places where you already maxed out, where you have already maxed out reputation. So those are probably locked off, but you could get little bits of more by doing them previously once every week, which is when they refresh if you'd already beaten. Get a little bit of Mora. Uh, you get the same amount of Mora when you beat them while still getting reputation, but it was a nice way to get a tiny bit of extra Mora and just do some fun gimmicky fights. I didn't think that would actually count towards my week's bounties, so that means I'll have to wait till next week. Okay. Alright. Mm -mm. I suppose the only thing is going to be wait till the next day and witness an amusing fight. I think we'll meet a funny guy soon, too. It's not unlocked. Mm -mm. Guess we could check here. I just want to see what their quests are. Children of Echoes, Tepetly Dissonance. Only four. Oh, right, because the third one is not unlocked like this patch cycle, because presumably it's Shilin Ends. Hmm. But, wait until next day. Huh. Then move back, start the next quest. I thought I'd be able to use bounties and requests to fill the time a little. That was. Very much not the case. Hmm. I also did a fun trial on this island, this hidden island before, which is apparently part of their story quest line. Their special travel quest line, but I just went ahead and see what saw try to see what happened and done it. You know, let me go there. I thought it'd kick me out of the area. It didn't. I was able to do a whole trial, so I'm wondering how the story quest is going to actually acknowledge that fact. Let's make it in the next day and see what we can do in the Archon quest then. But Bonnie and Kachina are taking lots and lots of maps to level. I mean, if it makes sense, because <laughs> give me a s taking a long time given that the, those enemies and the materials just showed up. Probably to grind a little for Kinich, but so I can probably wait a bit. Well I won't have to do it as much because he's not out yet. Got time to kill. Dragons for the sake of his stuff. 
Climb up here, we'll get another Pyroculus. As we'll get it, we're in the area just for fun. Top of this big old tower. Oh, well, oh, well. Give that to you. Take that from you. Big volcano with floating parts. We'll stop. And switch out. I'm... Okay, and there we go. Now, I wonder when that will come. The big thing is that to cure our dragon companion sort of evil disease, we need to take him to that volcano and pray, basically. That mountain over there is, I believe, the Animo Tribes area. A lot of mountains around here, really. It, to a certain extent, honestly feels as much a geo area as a pyro area. Frankly, most areas are very mountainous. The only exception is kind of Mondstadt. <laughs> kind of. So, it's over here that we have to go to, and can we... Still in focus, experience, but decision, make new friends, abundance of people, springs, leave members behind. Good to nothing a break before embarking on a new journey. Lots of typos in this one. Usually they're not this sloppy. Feels like a whole new planet if there's two days in the hot springs. Enter our relaxation mode. And time here really has felt like a vacation. <laughs> what are you? Because in the Japanese, if not swords, they do it with the same no hodl or Lakota and various northern and so north and south American languages taken to describe various creatures. It's Koholasaur. Hola is Hawaiian for humpback whale, if I believe. Basically, wizards that are like humpback whales. You can play with bellies, bouncy, it tastes snacks, delicious. So the road just this morning, what's she up to? Preparing for death. Some kids got caught throwing stones in the springs, not much has changed since we first met her about an hour ago. <laughs> Yaha! Guys, did ball last night. And she is basically the. T basically the not line girl. Everything's so nice. But you like it, taking guys out to do some sea fishing. You will ever catch. Fish fish delicious right off the grill. Usually it's only Paimon who has the funny money eyes. The kid at might have had similar ones once. Tonina. We're gonna get news about someone dying in battle. What do you need? It seems that fighting the Night World Wars returns. Kachina back as well. Fell in battle, and they all lost, which means she didn't get to be resurrected. The Hori team is victorious, but a resurrection held in stadium soon. Okay, so well. She died, but it doesn't matter. Awesome. <laughs> Death is cheap. It's really that Mrs. Cunning was her first time to stick to about to happen, but... Kini just died three times, he said, and been resurrected, because... People who fight in the Abyss Wars basically can come back to life if they die, which is... An idea. Six about to happen. We don't know about Kachina. I mean, Milani, even though she's fought three times, apparently. Deserves to pull her head up top. Oh, right. Three times undefeated. They did say that. Thanks for letting me know. I head out in a bit. Be in the back. I'll find Kinich again, but they've definitely sort of sidelined him. Seemed a little anxious there. I think it was bad news for a moment. The Abyss was cunning just now. Seems like the Abyss wants to destroy everything. All those monsters, well, were most of the Abyss monsters were made by gold, and even if they were accidental. Gold was basically literally an alchemist, magic scientist. Monsters attack a tribe, blow some sort of cunning plan, and... Ooh, we're getting some power issues right now because of... Funny lightning storm moments. If I drop out at any time, you know what's happening. We're sent to send them attack Kachina and her small team. Now that Palmet wants in the enemy in danger, just... Get it, but it's difficult to understand, that's for sure. It seems like the only goal is total destruction. Isn't a living entity after all? The capacity or water planning could possibly possess. I think it's got some kind of high mind. For one history of fighting the abyss, realize well, things aren't quite so simple. A hundred years ago, abyss invaded to that, and the cataclysm, Kandria, know about that. That's right, Kandria suffered greatly during that time, so did every other nation to that. Not only was the worst effect of all, more than Kandria. Combined efforts, the then Pyro Archon, heroes from every tribe to finally repel the abyss. Then Pyro Archon, right, because no one's Archons are human and therefore have natural lifespans. Unless they're cursed or have a mortal share power with them. So, effects of the invasion linger for hundreds of years, only able to reverse little by little. That's not. That was information revealed. 
previous quest. It's new info. Reverse a little by little. Tribes water is contaminated, shows back of territory over by dangerous sludge searching for underground. Underwinding black wings for slants of the flower for the clan, so presumably the animal clan. Zester designed for a specific tribe, understood the foundation of each tribe. Not the abyss's desire for destruction, it was a sort of primal instinct methods are in truth marked by intelligence. So it's slime marked by a unrelenting wind. So far, Feather Clan. People of the Springs, obviously, water, children of echoes, Geo, Sons of the Canopy, Dandro, Fire Feather Clan, so presumably Animo. Collective of Plenty is almost certainly Electro, so one's left would be the Masters of the Night Wind, sort of a group of occultists. And the only character we know from there, I believe, is Sitlawi, who is an, a cryo wielder, which raises the question of maybe it's a technically the Pyro Clan without any Pyro Vision wielders, maybe, but we did see a Teo with a Pyro Vision. She does confirm for us that vision element is not necessarily tied to your clan. But, hmm. Masters of the Night Wind. They didn't say anything about their element there. Accessor designed for a specific tribe. Big thing is that there was a weapon we got from Battle Pass last year, hinting at not on war a year in advance, which mentioned the six tribes, and only five of them mentioned a Saurian, a dragon dinosaur, in connection with him. Which will raise the question of whether one of the tribes doesn't have a Saurian and one of the Saurians doesn't have a tribe. This is our destruction, sort of primal instinct. Methods are in truth marked by intelligence. This is invaded the Night Kingdom. To master read the memories that land at any given moment. It's so dangerous and cunning, like it knows you inside and out. Unable to fully eradicate you after all this time. This will find the abyss been successfully addressed by their various power organs we've had over the years. MG and Sama. Fire God, great person. Every tribe is prospering, things are looking up. Just look at what a man should do, and a few days ago, totally fought them off. Yeah, which involved fighting a number of reptiles, which are the only pure abyss enemies right now, although weeks maybe suggest another pure abyssal energy enemy later. But it also had a bunch of weird purple. Saurians, basically abyss mimics, which was interesting. Other nations see how much effort it takes to truly eradicate the abyss. That one within its shadow every day. As in Samarit, we had to cleanse the urban soul to get rid of. Oh, what was the name of their. Eleazar, Eleazar. Which, in the English at least, was a reference to Lazarus from the Bible, actually, for whatever reason. In the Chinese, it was just scale disease, and I think the Japanese too. I will take for this word to end, if for what it's worth, the English localization oftentimes reveals things that are true, but not necessarily hinted in the names of the original one, two languages it's translated from. For example, Irvin Soul in Chinese and Japanese, just white trees, silver white trees, but it technically hinted at Norse connections to Conrad and the fact that their king was King Irmin, which is also another mythological name for Odin. At this point, every battle, every sacrifice, and pursuit of the future, where we get to stop fighting. Responsibility, duty, unavoidable burden, everyone not one views the war differently. Responsibility, duty, and burden, but no one enjoys it. We'll be ready to this one day. Efforts of all who fought against it become a story for the ages. Think my name could survive in battles best in future generations. It's kind of romantic. So presumably, the Oracle Quest will be about totally getting rid of the Abyss and Navan. I would presume. And Volcano. What was cool is that if you enter everything they look up to, drives them forward, do it, make them want to contribute. When you first come to Navan in the quest line, if you go on land, such as teleport, you can see the Volcano actually erupt. Guests here is always welcome in Navan. Now I can head to the stadium, fishing truck, and wait till the cheese is back with us. She's not going anywhere. Not if the abyss has anything to say about that, frankly. So, we're starting under Blackstone under a white stone. And given that <laughs> given that the people springs are kind of Polynesian, it makes me think of, of all things Bionicle. It it's kinda of telling to myself, maybe a bit age-wise, but. I was a big Bionicle kid, and also, 
I mean, for Bonico, only went on for ten years. Honestly, only really nine, because it fell off hard in the final year. But it was originally supposed to go for twelve, I believe. But it was cancelled because people wanted Lego wanted to move on to new things. I'm not talking about Bionicle, but it was very, very Polynesian. Had a lot of Polynesians and words in it. And they're actually sued by some Polynesian tribes. It's basically, stop using our language. It's disrespectful to our religion. And they ended up changing a lot of the name spellings, but not pronunciation, which was interesting. Oh, well. Alright. A cutscene's happening. And I think... This might be the appearance of a certain somebody. I'm excited. Chaska, Yansan, the two NPC stand-ins for Kinich and Milani, basically, and Kachina were packed already. Oh, right, she died. We gotta see her come back to life. He's gonna miss out his chance when Kalmar Heroes back in battle. Mona Glory. People were joking about first playable character death because of Kachina. And I got spoiled on that, but I thought she was gonna stay dead. I thought they were gonna lose and flee. I'm so flustered, never had this many eyes on her before, but. It would be. <sighs> They've had characters like Tepe, who we've seen and basically immediately see die. And the stakes were low, but if your Kachina got a character arc that we were actually with her all the way for, basically, as opposed to Tepe, who we basically heard, on, heard about secondhand, Junior's Up is a bit better, I suppose. But just the fact, the fact that she's a playable character would make it at least shocking. I'm not a huge fan of twists, but at least it would actually be a twist. It doesn't seem like the kind of person who likes being the center of attention. It's like I'm just in time. And this guy's got the same voice as Shiro from Fate. <laughs> Kinich, Mokitanaka, also here. Also here. Mission longer than expected, because the Dendro traps most associated with the adventurer's hill. Yeah, probably because they can grapple. But the instant with your trial mode, is everyone alright? Taking care of new friends got some tricks up his sleeve, just throwing Skechina men out to be. And better if I'd been a bit more perceptive. Maybe could have saved Atea sooner. Exactly. It's about to start. Come out Rosada Yuoji, sing the Ode of Resurrection together. Why are you eulogizing someone who's about to not be dead anymore? To encourage them to sing better, maybe? That seems like a pirate trap, so I guess the Tawala is just an outlier as a Chronovision ruler. In the power tribe, but that raises the question of what her exploration ability is going to be. She'll even have one. Well, to be fair, presumably it would make it mimic the power sword and therefore be flight, even if it has a different element associated. But if you sing and start swimming, we'd only be fine. It's gonna be a rhythm game. There was a rhythm game in 4.6 underwater areas special world quest. I read Kachina can spot us when she stops being dead. Mr. Kinish has died and come back to life three times. Is he gonna fail because of oil lines or something's going to go wrong, I swear. Not the Nagusha, more like graves or heroes. Cult of life. Natotila. Here is a memory and legend in there's Mavlika fake Marada basically. The guru alongside sun and wind. Forge on destiny in the future. Sun and wind. Oh, it's finally the lifeblood of our nation. Not the Mahomo. And then, okay, so when she powers herself up and turns golden yellow green hair mode, get that black flash. Interesting. I wonder if that'll happen when she actually. That darkness is a bit abyssal, maybe? I wonder what it should be like when she's playable. Some rumors that we might be able to use her a limited capacity next version. Oh, that capacity actually is, who knows. Oh, just a cutscene. Tail continues on. Glory passed through generations. It's kind of like what they did with the Yunjin singing Chinese opera. Courage ignites the sky and earth. How are we singing along? It's more victory heralds than that one's path. Oh. We'll wait for you, we'll sing for you. I'm 
come back, brothers, come back, heroes. How have we worn the song so quick? Once again, once again, burn, burn. Oh? And is it gonna not work, or...? Maybe my connection... Okay, I have to click through. And... Oh? Wait. Something seems like it went wrong. Maybe. Dead silence. Or? Could not find her within the night. Can't have located her ancient name. Oh, yep. Okay, so she does stay dead. At least for now. Ooh. Presumably we'll bring her back to life at the end of the Archon class. I imagine. Does that even mean? It is complete. Power Archon resurrected person emerged from the flames to gather something wrong. Exactly. So this tone of voice is very, very different now. What's going on? Never happened before. How'd you make that all? It's pretty obvious. Kuri team sent to the abyss. Didn't win after all. Bunch of frauds. Nevada overcame it's all victors. What is how it sounds? No, it's a way line issue. Orgon couldn't find Kachi in Night Kingdom, Tamu. More of it is a victory than meets the eye. I've gone over the fact that Chena beat you in the pilgrimage. It's after the both of you. Our guests are misplaced, completed our mission. I wonder what is up with her elf ears. You did? Who say what that little girl even contributed all? Got scared or ran off. Didn't count? Why I recognize someone like her even if she was on the winning team. And in Japanese, well, also in Chinese, it's... Japanese, it's Taide. It just means great spirit, basically. Who have got one like that? Presumably they also mean in plural because there are multiple wild ones who tried. The obsidian pillar is the method of communication. Sacked by Shelf for probably the best, and Zerbi subjected by rumors, not even here to defend herself. Down no point arguing with Alexa. Some people ship them. They just sit here and let them slander her like that. Kachina slander, insult the hero of not one person actually has to be a hero. No? You mad at everyone who thinks really at fault here? Never, never should have even gone to war. Great Pyrocon and Blizzard Nation suddenly stopped working. Well, what are you gonna say? Was it alive? Failed to achieve victory? Or, well, I've been sure victory in different ways. Bill didn't look all that strong to me. Ekate. Pyrocon seems to be deep in thought while she's putting a stop to the commotion. She is only a very powerful human. When the run, not like her at all. She's been waiting for this moment for too long. I'm down here the situation on how scared she might It's the first person to stand up and face it head on. Don't even know what happened. Don't dare try to use this excuse to vent your anger or slander her reputation. If that would happen soon enough, then we'll see who truly deserves going. Step expand. You try to fight us, sir? That's enough. Moe, she's gonna Basically, shut up. No doubt about today's victory, Kachina's pardon it. You are worthy of admiration and sound admiration. If you are today's survey, undeniable. It's not been rekindled. Offering you all my deepest apologies. Continue and investigate this matter. No further casualties. Suffice to spend a pilgrimage until this matter is resolved. So who's gonna find the abyss? What? No one is all-knowing. Except Sir Gideon off near the all-knowing. From the round table hold of Elden Ring. Kill me. No, it's infallible, not even my sense. It's repayment for all the Genshin jokes Mike po make while playing Elden Ring. That was a means by which we seek the truth, not a weapon we wield against others. It didn't mean that way, Argo. I'm just... Things you wish to clarify, ask me directly. Then my answer, if you wish, has your chance. The concerns state them. No, of course not. You have said nothing to change your mind, but it seems the truth never mattered to you at all. Doesn't even have the courage to answer the Pyro Archon's question. That gory talk earlier. So when is Kabatano going to show up? That's what I'm here to see. Where does the inscription fragments? Let's see. Let's see those. Change for chess. Questions and right, I got one from the Secret Isle today. Right, that was fun. We talked earlier and the other quests. 
Und jetzt so mehr? Schitzmon Yoroshi? Schau. Question if it's good. Hachina, any idea where she is? Extremely important to me. Yep, she said Hachina was basically her little sister. They said you were the best in the situation, but sorry, that's not enough. She had everything I know. I want to learn the truth. Ask your friends sooner. Join the investigation. Mm. What are you saying? Games all together, then. I am Mochiro Des. Des, come see me in the speaker's chamber. I went there before. Should join them. Getting our champions together. Do I buy as well? What about Kinich? Time to chat. Should everyone keep the travel chief's important progress to the investigation? So again, I apologize for the outcome of the ceremony and further questions. It's apart for now. Just to come along. Gee, yeah, let's go. Like, no, let's go down myself. So we're getting teleported there. And yeah, we've been in here before. I thought this might have been. Let's see all the flags of the tribes in here. I thought it might have been. Place for offerings, but it simply was not. It's about the forge, actually. Burning rock, some kind of wood ash, or especially urgent. She had a point, and I her no one. Deeply sorry this happened to her. But these are basically four out of the six heroes of Nalan, presumably. Yonsad had better be a five star. Chaska, we're pretty sure, is two. Then, besides that, I think Shilonan for Geo, five star, and then Satali for Cryo, presumably? Maybe the only Cryo period, and then, of course, Movika and Pyro Traveler, who. If we gotta wait this long for Power Traveler, Power Traveler better be good. I still contend Shibalanka is probably just an actual good Power Traveler. As in, we will become Shibalanka by inheriting his ancient name. That's why Weeks have said Shibalanka is a medium male, because, well, medium male. And therefore, actually good Power Traveler. Actually good Traveler, not named Dendro Traveler. Hopefully. Sorry, this happened to her. Rest Night King, especially since Night One is breaking some trends and sort of being rewarding and nice again. So Night King, Night What's Causing it, unable to track down her location. We find it, dress the cause of the unrest, or resurrection continue to be ineffective. Means because she won't be able to come back. So that, not until prompt Night King is resolved. How long will that take? Depends on the investigation. You say? Was dreamed of fighting the abyss, doing her part to defend not long. Was afraid of death because she knew if she came down with her orgot would be there to bring her back to life. And, well, uh -uh. Never sat down together, exhausted from training, always hung the ode of resurrection. That's some retroactive backstory for you. Honestly, this maybe needed a bit more build-up. Let's so come back here with us, hug her, celebrate with her, and share her joy. All the snacks we had ready. So cute. Support her every step of the way. What are we supposed to do now? Sit peacefully, wait for her to return, and yourself and grieve over her death. With her friends or her murderers. And the game specifically mentioned in patch notes that appearances and spots like imaginary theater and teapot are now totally divorced from past progress, which is probably because of what dead Kachina. Because Sartaglia, before, did not appear in the theater. If you had completed the Archon quest, because he was still recovering, or maybe, some people say, theorizing that it's because he sort of escaped his constellation in the theater, calls on people through their constellations to force them in. Maybe. Which means, you know, maybe <laughs> new Tartaglia, Electro Delusion, new constellation, I don't know. Turn, grief over death, friends, or her murderers. I come not to praise Kachina, but to bury her. Fair. Kachina is dead. Kachina remains dead. And we have killed her. Send her rage and your grief. Kachina's life means a great deal to Nilani. Bring her back as soon as possible, give you that peace of mind if I could. Here about the same, let's give you a broader picture of the issue we are now facing. Considering the recent attack on your tribe, Abyss has found new means of underwriting the rules of our nation. Attacking the ley lines. You mean? Sacred Flame, Foundation of Resistance Against the Abyss. Taking the flame through the ley lines of a week, if you hold the pilgrimage, then teams fight the Abyss, what would be more casualties? Stop altogether, Sacred Flame will only grow weaker. This will scare up their attacks, and the tragedy we saw with the people of the Springs will only be the first of many. Mm. These ring shaped pylons were portals for monsters to enter the world. We have the two choices, one seems to be the lesser of two evils. Sorry, no, the mess of Hush, and the name Nalipo. 
Turn fire. I mean, the cost is my very duty. Is that even mean? Turn fire. Okay, there's no definition of turn fire in a dictionary or anything. Just made up a word. Or presumably it means sort of a harsh person, which is really, really funny because. I feel like they had to have chosen him in part because he was Shiro and Fate. Genshin devs are objectively Fate fans. This is empirical. And Shiro's whole character deal was his dad was a cynical hero type character who weighed the cost and killed the few to protect the many while Shiro's whole deal was trying to save everybody. No matter how unrealistic, how truth can be cruel, understand and want to approach this rationally. The same alone, person for you, I'm like Kinuch, not a simple case of playing up which course of action is most painful. Kinuch and Yoroni, like Kinuch, unlike Kinuch. Shukashitaro. Sadness. Can't choose between them, don't want to. One is preferable over the other, just preferable for those who suffered. Mm. Saying it doesn't matter whether I spend a pilgrimage, consequences will be equally painful. Keep it going, but... Try to investigate as soon as possible, or if she breaks my heart, can bring myself to sacrifice other people for her sake. Crux of the problem, not a matter of choosing the lesser of two evils. Either way, people who suffer and end result will be the same, believe in the pilgrimage will waver. Once that is corrupted, people no longer unite in battle against the abyss, exactly what the abyss wants. Psychological warfare. The ultimate goal isn't to break the rules that make the Oda resurrection work, it's to break faith in them. This is require fate, or is it some sort of collective belief, like is fate or mage the ascension, or just a matter of actual political participation? And what happened with Kachina happened to anyone else, he suspended the pilgrimage, current plan, meantime, to strengthen the tribe's defenses. Another way of strengthening the sacred point to keep the abyss at bay. It'll be easy, time to figure out the best approach. Send your anger, Milani, and hope it provides some clarity at least. So it looks sad. I thought things were going to get over a second part. Archon took the time to explain everything so patiently. You have an apology, Archon. I must get carried away earlier. You're sorry, you're right. We're just finding solutions. Well, the pilgrimage without sending a team to fight in the night more and more is that way. So be able to fuel the sacred flame. Hmm. Oh, so that fuels the flame. So for that, two events in New York have always been wind. It would change, it would. Faith would waver anyway. Without the chance to fight the Abyss, for rankings or their prestige, can have a miserable draw. You've got to preserve what flame remains. If you're a participant, the amount of contending fire produced will decrease, and the cycle will continue indefinitely. Essentially, the Abyss is taking Kachina hostage. Same Night Kingdom for a long period of time, do we know, or he just die? Well, they want to do travel, so that can be something similar. Collective memory, short period of time, shouldn't have an effect on the person, the Abyss in the picture, a different story. Mm. Sense of self devoured until eventually become one of the sea of souls. So basically, you just stay dead. I mean, usually the first death is the last one. A cup of water to a rushing river, try to scoop up another cup. Every chance it'll be the same water you had before. Guys, they actually do mention Heraclitus here. Crazy. That can't stop in the same river twice. Let's sugarcoat it. Danger Kachina is currently facing. Like you said, Archon, but these problems need to be addressed. This all your efforts on dealing with the sacred home, I will go search for Kachina. This was the same threat to you as it does to her. They're possibly not return, knowing that you still choose to go. Hmm. She's waiting for us to rescue her, all that matters. For the protector during our campaign, can make it up to her now, she's to go as well. What do you think? Isn't how it should end for her? I promise she would have the chance to learn from me. To it, I'll support you in any way I can. Masters of the Night Wind take it and extract the ancient name from the Wailers. Is it sort of easier in on her? Find an ancient name, look between them. Confront your location with position within the Night Kingdom. Yagami Kumi. Night God, Night God Kingdom. Comes the hard part, visit in person and rescue her. Night Kingdom line of souls can even go there. Normal circumstances, only the conscious can enter a way to go there in person. Sort of. A lot of mythologies do have the idea of a terrestrial gate to the underworld. The Night Kingdom will attempt to repel you, and the Abyss certainly won't leave you be. It's just a bunch of ripped out and 
And this Saurian fight surprised the mages too, but probably not hill trolls. Fine by me. See if you're fighting against this is nothing new for me. Be a problem. The only one who's scared going. Problem's going too. This chest is voice actress. And. Hi, Dayuko. I do not recognize that name. Yeah, I gotta get a new board eventually. Satwali, Master of the Night Wind. Wait, oh, Masters of the Night Wind, yeah. Artifact used to communicate with a wild called the Spirit Speaker Stone. This is a ceremony the artifact wielded by the tribal chiefs. So probably go to Church of the Echoes. Probably they have a closer connection to Katuna. Ceremony the artifact wielded by the tribal chiefs. Spiritual quality means it can be used to search for an ancient name. So Satwali is the cryo, fortune teller basically. Apparently is old but looks young, kind of like Farzan, but different. She, Farzan was basically in the hyperbolic time chip, but Satwali presumably has some sort of longevity. She backed over to the camp a few days ago, didn't think I'd be hearing that again so soon. It's for help everyone. So we're necessary, offer you whatever aid I can. Fellowship, courage, or what will truly decide the success of this our nation. Well, it's me, can only focus on one thing at a time, after all. Hmm. I certainly didn't expect our first conversation to be so serious. Says Komatsu Mikako, who is, among other things, the wife of... The voice actor for Tomaki Maino, the voice actor... Maino Tomaki, the voice actor for Zhongli. And as such, so he plays the game a lot, and he said he'll be rolling for her. And was also joking about trying to get into the new area really. Right, hoping that you offer not one's high level of hospitality to why? Not what happened to the other nations. Complicated, making it worse than most. First time, basically. Complicated this sort, in the middle, repetition solid nowadays. More like it, after all, I've heard of someone who transcends fates. Sender, quite a lot about me. That sun wheel in the center of the seven, also her earrings, which are clipping through her collar. More than you can imagine, talk about that some other time. I think they should have baked in some better animations for that, given that the hair is baked in. The night for a drink, these well ambiance, important things to be done. I almost forgot to tell you when the fight against Sebas, wanted to, to give us, us to give us a new talisman. It embodies fond memories. I like to you see that my strength of will and what she has to tell us, so do you know what that means? Hmm, so she's a little surprised here. Didn't this day would come so soon, flames of her life force still been flowing within the talisman. She transferred her life into them, is it like a primal glintstone in Elden Ring? Another Elden Ring mention. Feather Agon is interesting. It's different, two of us could enjoy the hot springs together, what she gave me in person, it's supposed to be bodies after all. <coughs> this means a great deal to me, I should stay. Don't worry, take good care of once at all, but I'll pay her a visit. In what sense? <coughs> so then, what are they going to say? I want to jeopardize the production of fire. Not at all why I decided to spend the power on engines. Wouldn't work anyway because of the ley line damage. Not even now, production can be far, far from sufficient. Gradual mm. corrosion caused by the Abyss's world and mass massive shortage of pyro energy. Currently, the breaking point. Instead, Kurum is the last call, suspending a last safer strength to defend the tribes. Ah, so why should keep it going then? Well, because of the failed resurrection. This is about Abyss's catastrophe now, which is the severance of Nikon, is a direct consequence of that. Can't let the general public know that. Apparently, according to Files, she's a polearm. And Mavuika is like all Himiko's claymore. Well, I think it's all Himiko is different, though. Files do say that she might have a rocket launcher. All the quarter down instructions was at hand, there would be immense panic. I said nothing at all, would continue to question the integrity of Nalan's heroes. Talk about investigation, but basically mean nothing. Mm -hmm. Simple choice, query the better solution, choose otherwise. Prescribe a belief that the right choice is the one of the fewer sacrifices. It's really funny hearing Shiro's voice talk to her about that. It's going to still wait for the sacred flame to last a little longer. You mean... Come with me. So we've already left, so this is where we're going to see that fight, or... 
This is... Should be the fun cutscene, I think. Yep! Time for fun. This good foil must never go out, not only does it strike fear in the abyss, also the pill of non stability. So until we are ready, sacrifice my power to keep it burning. Presumably, that's why we won't get her until the end of the Archon Quest. The in game explanation, because she's got to keep power, so she'll presumably get it back somehow, though. I wonder if she'd basically just be a very strong normal human. It's not strong human as in not one style human Archon, but just not one style strong human. Well, so long, focus on the remaining ancient name bearers. Dispersion plan or judgment. Chosen by the lab, I've already embarked on the destined path. For them, it's not how that journey ends, not us. What we can do is support them. If you make a sacrifice, then have a Not me, then who? No other is capable of sustaining this sacred plan. Possess great strength, not above my people. This is part of my duty. Mm -hmm. And let's see. <clears throat> oh. And animal boxer, electro hammer, and let's see. Him. Sasuke and Natanaka. Forced to be wrecked with. Capitana the first. Secret Lord is no secret to me. Urshaker? Give her the Urshaker, destined for ruin. It's Kinish's sword. Five centuries ago, it's unfolding. See it blown? Uses the gnosis in the hands. Do you know what you mean? More than the Sarvitsa. Mm. It's a crisis, so let's pick up the mantle of salvation. Plan is reached in pass. Also me creating the rules for that one. For the dawn of the new age. Old must be destroyed. Sword moment? Uh-huh. We have his sword in the files, too. And of your speech. People like us, but our blades are the token. It's thin, but it's a long for a sword. This song is actually a little reminiscent of one from Fate, too. <laughs> I hate to say that. Specifically, the song Clashing Souls. We had a big spirit bomb, basically, but big ice boulder, multiple ice boulders, full power. It's presumably what her knights will look like, I would say. Jumping and cutting, and landing. Metal Gear Rising. Town ends. Block. And that explosion was her color, so presumably she won. But that aerial move that they're both going to pull off. Fire missiles. It's not that we're using a decent amount of elemental power, but. It's got this weird. black light aura on him. I wonder if that's a Sniznai game, some sort of anti night soul. Oh? Very bestial owl. And... Oh, Black Eyes? Yeah, that? Huh. And now that's his car, and then we're going. Okay. That Black Ice is. Very interesting. It's clearly she had some night soul stuff going on. You took a hit. And oh, fire on him. That is. cut in his color. It was more like a crack in stone. Some kind of mist, smoke. And he's gone. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
That's just the night witness and word. Captain and his followers must be apprehended. Huh. Okay, Black Eyes is gone now. They cleaned up. And about her pal, Dodger Vizca, Injin Sama. Are we right far enough from our old one? We're first of the Futui Arbingers. Someone can match you in combat. She reads it sent me. Why do you bring up what happened five centuries ago? How much as you know about now, why? It's personal somehow. Harbinger's old women are their personal goals on the purpose of the United States, collecting the Yosis. Captain's own reasons for being here as well. If his motive should for purpose of the Fatui, that game we're not prepared for done for. It is interesting that she was using Kinichi's claymore to avoid revealing her own design, I presume. And at a time, we're not afraid to pull back in the weekend for the time being. Besides, you notice the power that came to his rescue does not keep the masters of the night wind. Some kind of... A mole. An insider. Which is presumably either the fire or cryo tribe, but again, that doesn't necessarily mean it's the vision element. That's smoke, I think it'd be fire, maybe. But either way, I believe that was Oraron. Another one of the guys we've seen who also... Apparently is very, very old. This fought the Abyss with Kapitano a number of times among us. That necessarily proved to be a very valuable turn of events. The exchange found a bold sense of unusual presence within it, and we didn't investigate further. Unusual presence. That black ice was interesting. It's a non connection, I guess, maybe, yeah, it's his own unique. anti night soul, night soul, maybe? Now, she might look into it. Maybe the captain speaks to Star, she should know. Had I my name, still intend to. Yes, but fear not. Anzin. Gonna go and. Cool jump cut. All its strength has never rested solely in its archon. And another power up. Together we foresaw the only path that meets our nation's future. Let's trust in that vision now. We. So maybe Yansan has some sort of fortune telling too, or. But her closeness to Mavuika. Be fair, the same with Kinich. What will happen? And oh, okay, went off her, so presumably that power is gone now. Everything okay? What are we fine? We're making the fact that I never got a picture when I could still turn my hair into flames too early. Yeah, it's strange, huh? Let's hope the others have a safe journey. Mm -hmm. So, we got to see Capitano. And next objective is going to be going in the Night Kingdom. Fun stuff. Back over and... Oh! The aftermath of the fight. Huh. It's out of the stadium, something explodes. Archon Lloyd Chappelle must be finding formidable opponents. Check what's going on, doesn't have much time. Then the Archon won't lose in a one on one confrontation. Happened this time, but. She is actually named, head right back. Just keep climbing, really hopes nothing goes wrong. Alright, Battlefield of Ice and Fire. To reclaim an ancient name. Signs of a canopy. Okay. That's what sends us there, because it's a path that takes us past that stage, because you can't really check without the map, or just following the path somewhat blindly, but it's the one that would really take you to signs people of the springs of the before that wouldn't take you around the statue. So I think that'll be a decent place to end things today. Go over here to condense one more thing of resin, but. I'm just glad I got to see Capitano. I've been sprinkling world quests and other accoutrements in, but I did not expect Grindon String to support one's position. Didn't expect to only get through sort of one and one third of the two quests this week. So we'll see what happens.
but we'll condense more than a res it and tag out. It's been good. Happy to be here. Thank you for coming. See you all next time, maybe. Hopefully. Santa Ragon.